Good evening. Howdy, everybody. Corbs here with another Red Dead RP stream on Diablo RP as Lord Lightheart Valdemar. Blah, blah, blah. Hello, actor. How you going? So, hi, loving. How you doing? Hope everyone's having a, a nice. I hope everyone's had a nice Tuesday. Tuesday is done and dusted. Wednesday tomorrow. I'm excited because I've just got a four day work week this week because I get um, for the Easter long weekend, I get uh, Friday and Monday next week off, which is very exciting. So um, I imagine I'll do a, a bunch of um, uh, a bunch of um, Streaming, you yeah, know, at the very least, I'll do some more uh, Red Dead RP. Hopefully, some George Hughes and Valdemar uh, might stream some other stuff as well. Maybe some, you know, Hell Divers or Deep Rock Galactic Survivor. Maybe Battlefront Classic Collection if if things have been resolved there. Um, what else is going on? What else is going on at the moment? Um, maybe because there's a bunch of games, single player games, I've been meaning to get around to as well, like Crash Bandicoot 4, uh, yeah, see what I mean, but yeah, I hope everyone's having a good week so far, I'm on, uh, on as Valdemar tonight, got another Communist Party meeting <laughs> coming up soonish, and then, um, tomorrow night, I'll be back on as Hughes, uh, got some, um, got some, uh, got something lined up for that tomorrow, because, of course, if anyone saw the last Hughes stream, um, Iron Jaw made a return. Iron Jaw made a return at Clive Freeman's funeral. So, uh, he actually sent me a telegram saying that I should come up to the mountains, go up north to, to visit him, to, you know, see what he's been up to and, uh, talk more about stuff we were talking about the other night. Well, I'm tempted to go capture that player, but yeah, they're going to be jumping in a menu there in the clothing store, so I won't do that. I won't do that. But I won't do that. Because that'd be mean. But I need to get... Because I've been doing a lot of mining lately. Uh, so I've been able to get a cut hold of a couple of really good pickaxes. And the next step is I want to be saving up to get uh, a better wagon with You're more storage. Rich, so I'm making, I'm making, uh, you know, I'm making progress. Offline is Valdemar getting some money coming in. Lots of mining going on. Uh, the plan is, down the track, Salut, mon to um, maybe... Do some drug dealing as him. Which should be interesting. Now, yeah, is there any Fortress Cola going on? Yeah, yeah, there's some here. Let's grab let's grab some let's top up the old Fortress Cola, eh? Ten out of ten. Good. Uh, we've got some beans on toast, got some meat. Maybe just a little bit of food. Um well, The well. onion soup I think is actually pretty good. Because it's oh, like it does so. a decent amount of food and hydration. So I might grab some of those. Um yeah. I better put that metal on. Oh. Would you like me to join? Stop me? trying to spam items. I'm um, no, no, I was trying to I don't think so. That's too bad. Oh you can't I'm glad Oh, it's I'm under the jacket. Oh, okay. Alright, well. That's there. So I've got about I've got a meeting in the area soon with the Communist Party coming up, so we'll kill a bit of time. We might, um, well, it's night time, so you know what that means. You know what that means as Valdemar. Let's, let's do some fun. Let's see what's going on, eh? Let's see what's going on around town. Let me just grab the line of code there. We'll find somewhere discreet, eh? Yeah, Crash Bandicoot actor. I really enjoyed playing through the trilogy, the Insane Trilogy, earlier this year. 
finishing that up, and I'm really keen to try out four. It looks really good. It looks really great. So I'm really keen to just jump in and try... Do that. I've just had a bunch of... I've just had a, a bunch of stuff on, you know? Drink the blood. Om nom 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 nom. Bye, Lena. G'day. Howdy, partner. Alright. It's vampire bat time. Don't crash. Don't crash. <laughs> Could have crashed there. But I didn't because I've, uh, I'm a, I'm a professional vampire bat now. I don't crash anymore. Nope. I do not crash anymore. I know how to fly around as a bat and not crash headfirst into things. Not happening. Definitely not happening tonight. There, you, there will be no bat crashing. <laughs> you can count on that. Let's fly around. Let's see if we can spot any players. Oh, I think we've got a player there. Oh, did they see the bat and they're running now? They're like, shit! Where'd they go? Imagine just seeing a bat do a quick 180. Oh! I can't believe he just did that. Oh my god! Did you see that? That he just he just killed someone in town just randomly. Who does that? He's hiding behind the billboard there. I see you, boy. Then he just tackled that guy. What's this guy up to, huh? Who is this guy? this guy? Who, who just goes around St. Denis doing that to people? I would have no idea. Where'd he go? Because it... <gasps> we nearly crashed. Now, if there's someone I was going to drink the blood of, that's a very strong contender. I can't see where he went. Yo, Steampunk! Second job has started. Currently riding the Guama Gate. Sorry, I caught a bit of the, I caught a bit of the discussion of that on Dill's stream before I went to bed last night. Very funny stuff. Gua I like Guama Gate. That's so good. It's very funny. Looks like we've got a lot of uh, a lot of drama coming up, which is exciting. Keeps things um. You don't know how it's going to go. Hmm. Ah, bat! Hello, Fez. How you going, mate? How you doing? Now, it's also uh, very exciting. So, Hammer Razor, he's, uh, he's done some investigating on the server about locations that aren't really available to just anyone and he's actually found a really great spot that could become Valdemar's base of operations in the future so he's told me that when he's got the time he's going to be looking into making it available for me to enter like very much like a, an org hideout or something uh which is it's very very well themed for a vampire I'm very excited, very excited for that to happen. Like, especially if, if I can take uh, victims there, it should allow for some really great RP. It's very cool. Love to hear it, Fez. Dude, especially with your internet being hooked up at home. Love to hear it, dude. And looking forward to doing some more law patrols with you. And I'm excited to see uh, what you can do for the US Cavalry. Now, if you need someone to help you out with that down the track, uh, 
definitely keep Hughes in mind. I reckon I could make time for that, for those events, because that's... I love doing those. I would love to see more of those. I really would. Hey, Gazozo coming in with the resub. 28 months. Unreal. Thank you, Gazozo. How are you doing? How are you? Command has a job in show business. Never seen so many subs for any reason. <laughs> Dude, the, the stuff I heard him talk about. I was... I was uh, laughing very hard. And then, I, and then I had to try and go to bed after it. I was like, it was very funny. That's right. Look at this little sky kitty, huh? Just a nice little sky kitty. Definitely not a vampire in disguise looking for, looking for prey. Definitely not. Definitely not. Definitely not. Would adopt and make it wear a t-shirt sense. Would you would you make like a little outfit for the bat so that when he turns into the bat he's still got a little top hat and jacket and a little bow tie? Please tell me that's what you'd do. Because like that would be imagine seeing this little bat flyer and it's got a little top hat. Oh hell yeah, I love it. Wouldn't that be just the best? Simply the best. It'd be like the Avengers clothes designer, but for bats. It's a very niche business, but someone's got to do it. Someone's got to do it. I really wanted to land there. I knew what you meant. I knew what you meant. Don't you worry. Where are all the NPCs? Oh, it's pouring. It's coming down. Must be bedtime for all the NPCs, huh? Bedtime. So cold.
Goodness, we got that sideways rain. Check my mail in a hot minute. Oh, yep. Up to date. Getting my mining gear. Can you go in here? I think I check this all the time. See, there's you, there's stuff in there. Like, the doorway into the actual theatre part's open, but you can't get through these. Oh! Hello. Okay, you can force yourself in there. Just r sprint through the door, nice and safe. A lot of saying I need I need a thousand and something dollars for the wagon I want so I will have to do some more mining shifts soon probably over the long weekend
Oh, we've been blessed. Two kitty cats. Oh. <laughs> Cute. Might be time to head out just just to re make sure I'm not late. Um, I'll head out. We well, can actually. I'm gonna go have a look at that. You can actually get a boat out there. You still like go out swim, uh, fishing in the swamp. It'd be great one day when I've got enough money coming in from mining or whatever else to own one of these big houses as Valdemar. That would be really cool. Well, I suppose if I get that head, like that base, that sanctuary, I might not need one. Howdy, Minty. How you doing? Howdy, partner. Good evening. I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm super pumped that Tuesday's done because I, I just have a four day work week this week. So, um, I get Friday and Monday next week off. So. Four-day work week this and next week with a four-day weekend in between. Who's very nice. Adventures going? Well, it's great. Um, So Hughes has had m most, if not, like all, if not most of his memories come back at Clive Freeman's funeral recently. So Hughes is um getting very much into a... Uh, Hughes is very much getting into a spot where... Um, He'll be back in action doing lawman things for the first time in months, which is exciting. And then Valdemar, um, my next step with him outside of, you know, Communist Party meetings and this and that is to, um, is to be saving up to get a better wagon. And then I can really increase the workload of my mining shifts. So, so that's going well too, which is nice. Hey, stinkiest toe. It's our four month anniversary. Thank you for the resub. Four months, thank you very much. How are you doing? Tiger! What has our Lord been up to? Well, it's it's really just been I just haven't had time to jump on to jump on as him as much recently. Um because of all the other stuff going on. But yeah, we've got a Communist Party meeting soon. And yeah, saving up for a better wagon with more storage. Working working hard. 
Oh, don't worry, Poltergeist. Hughes' memory has come back since then. I remember it. And now Hughes remembers it. Don't you worry. It's been a while, but yeah, it should be... Yeah, tomorrow night, I'll be back on as Hughes. Doing some more Lawman stuff, but I'll be uh, I'll be going to catch up with old Iron Jaw up in the mountains. So it should be a good time. I'm really wondering what what's in store for us. I think I think tomorrow night should be a good Hughes session. So yeah, there's some gators out there. So you can Hello. get Hello. welcome. What boats have we got now? Swamp rowboat. Tree trunk canoe, ready to do rowboat, swamp rowboat. Oh, okay, so you can only use certain okay, boats out in these parts. <laughs> oh, Balter, guys. Don't worry, Hughes has upset a lot of people recently with his whole amnesia arc. But, you know, it's not personal, it's just, you know, he's, he went through a bit of trauma. He's had a bit of amnesia, but he's on the mend. Yeah, things should be looking a lot better for Hughes. Just everything will be right as rain. Nice and peachy. Yo, Hammer, how you doing, mate? We out in the swamp. Just killing time. I've got just under half an hour until the next <laughs> Communist Party meeting. What, what else is around here that I've never really looked at? Oh, there's a house for sale out there. We might go to have a quick look at... Just curious. Some of these properties I, I've never really seen or remember. So I might just kill some time, go have a look up there. <laughs> Fuck them. Good old George Hughes coming back with a vengeance. <laughs> Steampunk. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Until the lawmen go off duty and give you cement shoes. Oh, that's right. There's this little abandoned place. Forgot about this. Oh my god. Oh, it's not night time. I can't do any grave robbing. It's daytime. That's right. <laughs> What's up here, eh? What's bloody up here, eh? Let's have a look. See. Oh, hey, little house. Private property. Oh, that's not a bad location. Oh, that's right. You got the Vulcan blacksmith over there. Oh, there's a stable there. I didn't know there was a stable there. How have I missed that? I don't know if I've ever been to that distillery. We've got a little bit of time. Let's go have a look. Not a bad little spot. <laughs> oh dear, steampunk. Oh, oh dear. Dear, oh dear. Things are about to get super spicy. Oh my. Exciting. Well, that's good. You know, over the next month, you know, have some exciting stuff happen on the server because I, like I've said in a, a recent stream, is that a whole bunch of the the owner, like D and Donkey, the owners of the server, and a bunch of the streamers and players are going to be out all together at an event in Sydney. So there's going to be uh, 
Don Don yeah, Donkey, who's of course most famously known as the Mountain Man. D, who's now the commander. There's going to be Hammer Razor here in chat. There's going to be myself. There's going to be Dopey Dill. There's going to be Lontre, who's, who's Lawrence Ironjaw. And one of the, the Golden Nugget. There's going to be, hopefully, Fez, who's Wyatt Ames in the Law Department. There's going to be Nutties, who's Smiley Joe in the Law Department. Um, I'm not 100% sure who else. But at the very least, there's that. So... I've been peer pressuring Donkey and D to be like, dudes, you guys should do like a neat little, almost like a little panel at this event we're doing. It's a streaming marathon for charity where they can talk about their experience running a server and, and their experience with Red Dead RP to date and, you know, their favorite memories and stuff while the server's been up and then chatting to some of the streamers. And that I know it'll, be, it'll be like a little Diablo RP panel, and I really hope, I really hope that happens. But I've been peer pressuring them because I was like, "Look, ideally, you want to do a panel like that later in the year or next year at like PAX or another convention, yeah." So this would be a great opportunity to have like a practice run, and then you know we can, um, you know, I'm sure the Diablo RP community will be let know, will be no, will be told about the event and then they can tune in and they can see you know pull all these faces to names and it'll be like a special little thing it'll be, it'll be really cool i really hope it happens but at the very least we'll get some photos it'll be a, it'll be a good time <laughs> catch the mountain man irl that's right dude just just you wait till you hear donkey do the mountain man voice in person it's something man literally he's there at pax last year with us and he's wearing like a cowboy hat and shit and he just comes up and he just comes and he's like well it's all about the beans and that it's dude it's like ah! it's scary it's great and then you get you get d to do his um terence waters impression in person he's like hey hey boys yeah hey, yeah hang him it's so good dude it's great. I love it. I'm really looking forward to seeing everyone. And it's going to be a good time. We've still been meaning to get, like, a photo. I was meant to do it at PAX. Get a photo of the OG... Like, the OG beta lawman. Which was, under Wolf, it was myself, Ames, Smiley, and Iron Jaw. I was meant to get a photo of the four of us together, but I completely forgot to hassle everyone about that. So hopefully, we can get that photo next month in Sydney. I'd really like to get a photo of that. Um, how much time we got? Oh yeah, I should probably head there now. Oh, Donkey's Jack Goodman character is so funny. It's great.
<laughs> hey, donkey. What didn't you do? Let's be real. What didn't you do? <laughs> very, yeah, he's a very funny character. He's a right stitch up, yeah? Now I'm trying to remember, it was, um, even just, you could hear it in your voice where you're like, well, the brief had said to go further down the river, or beyond the bridge, like, like a real, like, reminder, like, guys, we're trying to do this Ames return event, and you've gone to the complete wrong spot, like, it's, it's meant to be down there, like, wink, wink. What are we doing? Like, like you're not supposed to be here. Oh, dude, you could, you could, um, you could hear it in your voice, like, guys. The instructions were really clear. Who's that? Is that one of them rocking up? What's the bet that's Dick Dome? <laughs> Unheard of, fat loot. Unheard of. Uh, what's the bet this is Dick Dome? Maybe? Is that... Is that even a player? I don't know if that's him. Is that an NPC? Oh, this is mud. Yeah, it's just some random dude. What? Not every old man is dome. They should be. Should be. The fuck is this place? Hey there, mister. Good evening. Place. Hello. I've never been here before. Hello. Hey, more mean. Howdy, partner. If I wasn't about to um, if I wasn't about to have a communist party meeting, I'd be murdering everyone in here.
no idea this was here. Press E at the spot. <laughs> oh, well, oh, they, they, they attacked me. They attacked me. Oh my god, I had to defend myself. Oh no, and then all this blood got in my mouth. Oh no. How did this happen? How am I supposed to hit that? Gotta have Jedi reflexes. Hey, Daddy Crude. Oh, it's a it's a piano stream now. I'm going well, mate. Hope you hope you're good. Said it before and I'll say it again. It is really hard to hit some of these uh some of these bits. Oh mate, how I hope New Zealand's going amazingly. Hell yeah. I'd love to go to New Zealand one day. Hey, Texan.
That sounds exactly what, like what I'd expect, Daddy Crew. Love to hear it. See, if I ever go to New Zealand, I'd love to do all the, you know, go see all the Lord of the Rings stuff. But then also, I'd also like hit up Brox and be like, yo man, would you be cool if I came around and you can show me around where you live and like actually show me some actual like Maori culture stuff. Like that side of the country as well. That'd be awesome. I didn't even go just just watch him do some wood carving for a bit. It'd be fascinating. But I'd love to go to you know go to Hobbiton and that. Oh, yes! I geek out, man. should be arriving soon. Why, the other members of the Communist Party, of course. <laughs> we were having our latest um, Communist Party meeting ahead of the an election tomorrow night in in the game they say the auction's gonna be big as it's ever been <laughs> my pals wait what happened Zozo? in Pal World! Oh, Zozo, I haven't played Pal World in ages. Oh, no. Yeah, I imagine my base is, uh... Yeah. Yeah. I was really hoping to be playing lots of Star Wars Battlefront online, but... That classic collection did not have a good launch. And just some of the stuff I've been hearing has been really off-putting. Like, apparently they were like, Nah, we're not going to use any modded stuff from the community. And if we were, we'd credit them. And they said, but uh, no, we're not going to put any in the game. And what they do? Had modded stuff included that they didn't credit. That is not, that's not cool. That is not cool. It just, I felt like we got, we were, like, I was having so much fun playing with you, Gazozo, don't get me wrong, but it did feel like we hit the point where the real grind began. Like, a lot of the pals became really hard to deal with and, um, you know, keeping everyone fed and happy and that. And, like, catching things became a real chore and I was like, I don't like this part. Now, Thursday night, I might be doing another stream. I'm really intrigued about this game coming out this week called Outpost Infinity Siege. Which looks really cool. It's like, it's a first person shooter where you have control of like a base where you can arm it up with like turrets and a whole bunch of defense things. And so you can then like zip out into like a RTS camera and deal with that and do little RTS stuff. But then you can go first person and fight on foot. And it looks really hectic. Like you've just got these insane waves of enemies coming in. It looks really cool, but I. 
I or I'm I'm already fearful of how my computer will handle running it. But then I'm just based on the my experiences with new games over the last ten years. I'm picking up vibes that it might be extremely unoptimized and not ready to go at launch. So I'm very, I don't know, I'm umming and ahhing. It looks really cool, like the kind of game I'd be into, but it just, and I feel like it might be a bit microtransaction-y. I've um, just got a bad feeling. We'll see. No worries, crude. Thank you for the lurk, mate. Thanks for checking in. And you keep having a wonderful time over there in New Zealand, man. Very jealous. Very cool, man. Where are these guys? You know, it's the damnedest thing. I swear. They should, they should be. What's that before? Maybe they're waiting outside. Let's go have a look. Well, I made nineteen dollars from that. Evening. Where are they? Uh, where did I come in? No sign of them. I don't have a lantern, do I? No, I do not. I need to get a lantern. For the aesthetic. But I am a very punctual fella, so there's a chance that they will be a few more minutes. I can wait a bit longer. Richard Dome? No, it's just the, uh, it's just, it's just rowing man. It's just rowing man. What well, was a gator? Two gators. Oh, they said 7.30, not 7. They said 7.30. Oh, whoops. They said 7.30. Wow, I'm really early. Okay, we got time to kill everyone in the building then. And hide the bodies. <laughs> <laughs> Audi.
Got him. Oh, they, you know, they've had a... They've had a few drinks. And now there'll be no eavesdroppers on the meeting. See, oh, this is smart. This is very smart of me. Yeah, I'm making sure that there'll be no eavesdroppers. Yo, Battle Tanker. It's going well, dude. Dude, traveling through the... Partner? Partner? Oh, sweet Christ! Um, yeah, it's going good, dude. It's going good. <laughs> Is someone able to clip that? <laughs> it's going good, but yeah. Um, the week is going by quickly towards the four-day weekend, which I'm really excited about. Um, how are you? <laughs> Hellfire! Oh, for fuck's sake. Get... This is... This is getting out of hand. Stop! Spawning. Gonna come back and there'll be another one. <laughs> oh, I think we got them all. All right. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Hello, sir. No, they just won't stop. Oh, I've got the links to say, but that, that, no, that'll be right, Battle Tanker. I'm sure that'll be right. Spinning, damn it. At the very least, then I'll be able to see it in the, in the VOD and I'll be able to go back and have a look. Thank you very much. That was fair. that was great timing. <laughs> All right, so you kill some, and they just they respawn so, uh, quite quickly. No, so, all right then. well, do I just keep Howdy. piling up the bodies, and then they'll be like, "What happened here? Like, they attacked me." Yeah, all right, we're running with that. We're running with that. Damn you to hell! I will kill you! 
kill you today. You hear me? I almost put you in front of God himself. They attacked me! Oh my god, they attacked me! Oh my god! Oh, fat loot. That, that, that'd be some, uh, that'd be some, uh, that'd be some good RP. They come in, he's me just dead on the floor. Surrounded by angry cowboys. Do 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 we got time to kill. We got 20 minutes to kill, so it'll be fine. Yeah. Oh my god, I can't believe they attacked me. <laughs> Content. It's hard running a bar. <laughs> It's important to clean as you go. Yeah. Valdemar is definitely not a vampire. Definitely not. I don't know what gives people that idea. He is 100% non-vampire. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> Just a massive pile room. Please don't pay no attention to the pile of bodies. They, they attacked me. Oh my god, I had to defend myself. They, I can't believe it. They just attacked me out of nowhere. My god. I, fuck. Stop. Stop spotting. No. How much? We still got another 15 alone, minutes. Oh, for fuck's sake. Do 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 Ba 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 bum ba 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 bum. Oh, you want some then? Oh, oh my God, they attacked me! You can stay. As long as you don't say a fucking word. Don't attack me, please. See, she's waving. She's like, hey! <laughs> they, they attacked me! Oh my god! Can you believe this? Unbelievable. 
Maybe if I leave one, they won't respawn. <laughs> She'll just be in the corner of the meeting with her hands up like, hey -o! That'd be that'd be great if um if I hadn't been super early. I only have myself to blame. That's it. Stay right there. Come on. Cock sucking bastard! Whoa, jeez, come on, mate. Calm down. There's no need for that kind of language. Yeah, all right. This is a uh, morning partner. This is as good as it's going to get. Heard there was a stagecoach robbery somewhere in Roanoke. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, how are we doing? Good evening, how are you doing? I'm not too bad, I'm not too bad. Give me one second. That's quite a tune. Well, I figured I'd uh, lighten the mood a bit before you fellas arrive. That's kind of, yeah, it's fucking creepy as shit down here, I tell you what. Oh, you don't know the half of it. You've seen the, you've seen the room around the corner with just a bunch of people? Oh, yes, they attacked me. But for me, they're standing up all fucking dazed and confused and scared the shit I had, I... Here I am, playing the piano, you're passing the time, and I must have played something they you know, they didn't quite like. And they all just jumped me, so I had to quickly jump, spring into action. Spring into action. Yeah, well, you're playing good stuff now, so hopefully... Yes. The blood is certainly pumping. Like this one. This one's a bit upbeat. Well, they, uh, they seem to get the message that, you know... Unless you, if you want to hear a certain song or don't want this song, then you can bloody well play the piano then, huh? <laughs> that is quite a good point, mister. Like I'm just, I'm trying my best here. I respect it. I won't be removing the mask at any point during this little meeting just because I got to keep my uh, current appearance under wraps. Why, what happened? What's well, wrong? I got a, I got a $410 bounty issued by the sheriff's department. What? I'm what? going and uh, a little bit undercover, and I would like no one except very few people to know what I'm looking like. Understandable. Well, what, what did you do to get such a bounty? Well, uh, attempted kidnapping, mass murder, aiding and abetting, bank robbery, attempted murder, more kidnapping. And this was all for place. people that deserved it, right? Well, it involves sheriffs mostly, and banks, so, uh... Oh, would well, they just march through St. Denis with their armored horse and shoot up the town whenever they like it? That's... you're merely playing fair. Exactly. I don't think I did much wrong at all, really. And, you know, most of the people that I quote-unquote kidnap come with me willingly after I use my charming good looks on them. Yes. Oh, that's a bit... that's a bit extreme. 
Yeah, they're ridiculous. They've, I got like six hundred dollars in unpaid fines, and they decided to put a bounty out. So, uh, so is this six one thousand dollars all up? Yeah, pretty much. Oh dear. It's only gonna go up because I ain't, I ain't getting caught anytime soon. I'll tell you that much. I'm what? gonna do another robbery later, probably. What are you doing after the meeting? Did you do <laughs> rob it up back? That's what I'm fucking doing. Do you need help? No, I should be all right. I got some. Uh, some associates that are going to uh, assist me. Oh, very good. Yeah, fucking moving up in the world, and uh, sheriffs don't like it one bit. No, they just want to keep everyone down. Exactly, especially uh, gentlemen like us that are fighting against the uh, against the state and the bourgeois. That's right, goddamn bourgeoisie. Filthy pigs, I tell you that much. Despicable. Oh, I like this one. It's a fine little ditty. Yeah, it's got a bit of a uh, got a bit of oomph to it. So we're going on an adventure. <laughs> Where's it gonna go? I I don't even know. I think it's gonna keep picking up and then it's gonna uh, slow down a bit at the end, maybe. That's it. You'd relax. Enjoy yourself. I'm hitting this shit. I'm getting jiggy. <laughs> anyway. Oh, really, Steampunk? Oh, so you're writing it, the edition, and painting Guama in a bad light. Oh, no. Oh, my. I'm really hitting this shit right now. That's it! What, fantastic. A little hop and a skip. Oh, you know, on a cold winter back home in Transylvania, you got to keep warm, limber up the fingers with some nice piano. Oh, I know the truth. Well, I don't believe Mr. Uh, Mr. Year is going to be joining us tonight, so we can just uh, get started. All right. I'm keeping the mask on just because I need to keep my appearance under wraps. All right. Well, thank you. Gonna drink through the mask, it might waterboard me a little bit, but that's all right. Jesus Christ! Right. Well, I suppose it's been uh, too long since I our uh, last meeting. It has well, been quite some time, out of the and rooms quite a few things have saloon changed saloon and developed since. Hard for that family, I guess. One of our well, biggest uh, biggest opponents is gone, which is a good sign. Really? Yeah. Yes. Uh, mad dog is dead. He's sleeping and sleeping under the ocean. I've heard. Yes, I, I did that myself. Oh my God! Good what man. happened? Uh, following a shootout in my saloon, the sheriff took him down to the police station to uh, interrogate him. He wasn't cooperating, and he said, uh, "Live by the sword, die by the sword." I thought he died by it. I had the pleasure of. Throwing him off overboard on my on my boat, and uh, he's just swimming with the fishes, so to speak. Oh my goodness! Good stuff. Now, you know, we have a bit of a uh, uh, knocked a tree right down on um, my house. That's the way it is. That's your problem. You know, cut one head off, two more right come out. Uh, that is how it goes, like the Hydra. Yes, yes. Since uh, since cutting his head off, 
we've had uh we've had another group coming to town who uh quite an old group but uh they haven't they have made themselves somewhat present not really I haven't seen them in the last day or two so i'm not too sure how serious they were but they came into my saloon uh, asking who owns it who runs the place and because they wanted to buy it because they want to make saint denis their foothold they want to claim saint denis oh my god we can't let that happen you know there's there's no room for a power vacuum no so in saying that we must step in and claim saint denis is our own it's our town Yes. It is, it is ours. It's the people's. Yes, it's the yes. people's. I heard there was a stagecoach robbery somewhere. No goddamn Rado. little little I groups running around that. owning the place. It belongs no. to us and the people. Certainly not. And then we need to protect the people. Ain't that the here, truth? Here, here. Um, so, in saying that, I want to make us more well known in the community. Whether it it starts uh, starts off with uh, us robbing a few banks, <laughs> you know, dividing the wealth amongst the, the 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 less fortunate. Absolutely, I agree. Love it, and uh, even start holding a few few parties now. Definitely, I believe we'd need to uh, need to get some. Uh... Some recruiting going, you know, yep, hold some yep. events and uh, spread the word. Yep, yep. Uh, I have two recruits in mind. I'm thinking of uh, recruiting Arnold Devlin and Ulysses Duke. Well, yeah, I know those two fellas quite uh, quite well. They would be valuable additions, I imagine. Yes, yes. I understand uh, Mr. Duke does all... Mr. Duke, uh, Mr. Arnold runs a gun store in, uh, Ainsburg. Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Uh, Mr. Duke is a priest, ain't he? Yes, yes. He runs, uh... Oh, the priest! The, the yeah, he runs the Rhodes Church. Right, Mr. Oh, Rhodes Church, bet. man himself. Well, that's, that, that gets us in a few new locations, you know. Mm. San Denis Rhodes in, in Ainsburg. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Good, nice little, it's like a triangle on the map. Yeah, yeah it is quite good. Yes. Yeah. Hey, Skeletons. Um, hey, Hagelon. Yes, and I think there's uh, been a few new developments within the criminal underworld since uh, Mad Dog has, has his head gone, and now, to my understanding, Black Hand is no more. And I think uh, the ruling has changed. Is that so? Yeah. So I've, I've had rumors, but I'm uh, You won't believe it. Sandy will damn near got me while I was squatting her. quite interesting. Well, mercy me. Mm. Yeah, well. Yes, so I reckon we need to start doing some more recruiting, though, for one. And probably, I mean, I have, um, currently at the moment, I have eight dynamite yeah, no. uh, stored away. So we have at least eight bank robberies we can do yeah i got i got about five in my uh i have my one little, a little area well yeah. that's that's a, fucking, that's a good few bits of dynamite we've got yeah, between yes, the three of us yes yes well that's quite good um i'm also thinking out seeking out a few different business ventures but uh i think i might might let that boil for the meantime to simmer yeah, I agree. get the money Did coming that. in first. Yes. Now, um, I once uh, uh, tried to help with a bank robbery with the Nuggets, but mm -hmm. they uh, they had me the trying to uh, with me on it. to crack the, the safe. The now, oh dear, I could well, that go for you? I could find the first number. It yeah. seemed quite easy, but the second one, I had absolutely <laughs> no chance of finding it. Do either of you know how the hell to do it? I am a prolific safe crack, if I do say so myself. Oh. Yeah, I, I was going to say, I think, Vince, there's no... Uh, easy I've got, around I got sticky locks. fingers when it comes to locks. Oh, good, because I was about to say, don't, please, don't make me crack any safes until I've had some yeah, training. Yeah. I have no idea what I'm doing. I think we get Voldemort on the negotiations. Yeah, yeah. Hey, <coughs> then... <coughs> Sorry. Oh, good. <coughs> and then, uh... 
And then uh, not only can we do banks, but I've also heard there's quite a few bourgeois capitalist paintings in the art gallery that should be uh, taken down and confiscated. I have, I have been told of that. I think we could start our own little collection okay, as a yeah. uh, as a monument to the destruction I of heard tell uh, about that. Yes. capitalism. Yes. Anyway. I think it is also imperative that we do uh, discuss the fact that... Uh, we do have a, mi a missing member tonight, and yeah. uh, it is important to note that it, as far as I'm aware, he is actually missing in general. Uh, I've seen some posters uh, claiming that he has gone missing. Uh, I, I do know a thing or two about the situation, but I think it is important that just in case uh, either of you weren't fully aware of it. Yeah, Mr. I'm, Yuri I'm is, fully uh, aware of the situation. Uh, quote, Yuri. unquote, uh, missing. Yeah. What happened to poor Yuri? He might be dead. We don't really know. Oh my yeah. god! But uh, yeah, he's uh, he's he's been gone for a little bit now, and it's quite quite a concern. I haven't heard from him in uh, in quite some time. Where, where mm. was he last seen? Oh, where was it? I think it was uh, Ansberg, actually. Don't tell Albert. Oh, I saw his oh kid. No. Susie, was it? Poor Yuri. Well, she was stumbling yeah. out of the rooms in the damn saloon last I'm sure he'd be, I'm sure he's fine with, I, I, I'm sure he's fine wherever he I'll is. Oh, I'm, I'm sure he's all right, but I think, yeah, it was just, uh, something important to, uh, Voldemar seemed a bit shocked by it, if I'm being honest. So well, I see, news to me. I know, yeah. it's, uh, it's bad business, something's, something, ha he went missing with a yeah. few folk, actually. I swear it wasn't me. Well, I believe me. you. I, I believe you. I think if it was a, uh, if it was you, Richard, I think we would have found Yuri at the bottom of a cliff or something. Yeah. Well, I know. I know. At our last meeting, we did have some words about his uh, situation with he, with he, with his, he, with his current connections with people. So. Yeah, yeah. I have also. Yeah, there is uh, lots going on there. I do have uh, another member in mind that I might. Uh, I won't discuss it now, but I'll, uh, I might contact him and see what he thinks. Man, the more the merrier, I always say. Yeah, there's more cattle I agree, I agree. Valentine. As many as we can get, People really. People saying it's outlaws. Mm. What mm. the hell is the matter with this place? But uh, what, what, what are we thinking in regards to uh, not only having a communist event, but actually announcing ourselves to the world uh, more openly than just yeah. posters? Because at the moment, we've only really communicated by putting posters up that have been uh, well, ripped down quite frequently in Valentine, I've noticed. Yep, uh, yep. But uh, yep. yeah, what, what are we thinking about uh, yeah, having a little announcement of our uh, our plans in existence? Well, I do have my election tomorrow night, and hopefully everything goes smooth and I get voted in, and then we can do, we can, we can make a big announcement of... Uh, Having an have, have an announcement party, get people in and collect some collect some uh, loyalist members. That is a good. Uh, how, how do we vote? I'm curious on that. I, I, I'm uh, not informed on that yet. On the day, uh, we pretty much just me, <laughs> Gavin, <Gaffer and> vote. <laughs> but you're just running around asking people to vote for you. Do you yeah, right? no, so I'll be I'll be standing in Saint Denis, and people will be coming to me and be. Putting a vote down for me or All right. no just, one else, I guess. We just write on a piece of paper. Yeah. Oh, I'll do, I'll do the writing. Okay. Am I able to pre-vote? I'm not sure if I'll be around tomorrow. Yeah. If if you want to pre-vote, you can pre-vote. I'll put your name down. Hundred percent, my friend. I think I think just this vote alone secures you the election. That's it. It's done. Not many fucking Look competitors at in uh, in old San Nee. I know there's Dolores right. out in Rhodes. That's about it. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Well, see, new mayor of Saint Denis. It might be that way. I'd have to. I have to say, unless you get some uh, sneaky competition running up, last minute. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I I think uh, Buttery was joking about it last night. Uh, the other night in Guama, and I was like, "Don't you fucking dare, boy." <laughs> that would be something. Well, I mean, you've got two votes here. That's all I can say. With me on it. Nothing new under the sun. What have they done? Keep it okay. down over there! I want to point out that Voldemort keeps making real sketchy eye contact mm -hmm. with me, like he's looking to the side like he's on speed or something, and he's oh, dark, his little eyeballs around, and it's creepy as shit. These sons of bitches over there, they talk very loud. Hey, hey I'm talking about you over here! Keep it down! This is a public place! Yeah. 
Sorry, isn't it being a public place in planet they can probably be about as loud as they wish? No, it's rude. Everybody it's rude. should be talking at a nice normal volume. Yeah. I mean, there's a guy behind us who's passed out at a table, so I don't think we can really expect much. Yeah. Like, uh, yeah, I mean, it ain't the, the best establishment. Sadly, I do have to say that last, the, uh, where we had our meeting last, uh, the owner who got to pay his rent in that building that got uh, <laughs> taken right up by someone else. House. Oh, really? Just like that? Well, that ain't good. Yeah, I lost yeah. the uh, I lost that place you sold to me. I was gonna so, try selling it to someone, and then a day later, I checked and I missed my fucking rent. It's gone, and I'm like, I can't be fucked trying to get it back. Yeah, yeah, I did see that. I was like, I was wondering what that was about. I was like, God fucking damn it! Yeah, I put I put a poster up on a couple of pin boards, and then the next day, I went back to check the house, and it was fucking gone. And then and then the following day, it was bought. It didn't last long. Yeah, hey, someone already got the son of a bitch. Oh, uh, yeah, well, it's a good spot. It is quite the spot, but, uh... You get what you get, I suppose, and uh, I should have checked the, uh, the mm. rents on it. Yeah. Now, Mr. Right. Dom, question. Mm. I've been hearing more and more about these other beverages, like TJ's Pepper or whatever, and, uh, Poppy, Poppy Orange Juice. Are they becoming a problem for you? You won't believe it. Sandy will no, be near no, no, not really. T.J. Well, Peckers is just a me. disgusting, fake, putrid knockoff, and then pulpy orange juice is just fucking orange juice. This is just always made by the Pope Daddy, I heard. Yeah. So he I, calls himself. Yeah, I, I have heard rumors, though, that there is uh, some fortress caller in it. I've uh, yet to see if these rumors are true. Can't believe it. All you need is Fortress Caller. Why would you want to have some second rate drink? That's what I, yeah. I say. Fortress yeah. Caller and Apple Lemon Smoothies get me through the day. <laughs> mm. I mean I mean I had a fucking issue the 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 other day, fucking uh Dolly's of Dolly's Lolly started selling TJ Peppers and Saint Denis and I was like and I started to see red. Well, That's not good at all. Did you deal with it? We've got plenty of dynamite. If we need to go blow up a lolly stand, we can uh, <laughs> we can put a bit down or get a... Yeah. I, heard that, I, I know that Mac gentleman likes to run around with dynamite on his back. Maybe we can send him in and sit away and shoot him in the back. Yes, yes maybe, maybe. A noble sacrifice. Yeah, well, he somehow managed... I think, I think he's got some sort of... Uh, his mutations keep him... Uh, he got really hard skin or something, because a lot of times he just kind of stands back up after it. Oh, yeah. I don't know what's wrong with him. Yeah. He's a fucking mutant. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. People keep thinking he's inbred. He's just a mutant. He, he he got something wrong genetically. Yeah, there was a rumor going around that one. He was, he was one of my children. <laughs> That's a horrible rumor. <laughs> yeah. Well, when yeah. you're mayor, we're all your children. Yeah, 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 children right. of the city. That's right. And you'll be all under my watch. Yes. Okay. Damn saddle's been chafing me wrong. Now, when do we, we, do we want to is. put a date on our first uh, you know, group bank robbery or something like that? Yeah, we could maybe do, uh, what are we thinking? Maybe like Friday or something? Yeah, I could do Friday. I I could, I, I believe I could do Friday night. Yeah, yeah, all right. Then we can do Friday night. Uh, that sounds good. Then we'll definitely do it. Uh, Become mayor, uh, mayor on Wednesday, back robbery on on Friday. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Something. Keep the keep it keep the train rolling. Ain't uh, 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 the truth. Uh, what's the sheriff trying to do? Pull some bullshit where they're like, oh, because you robbed the bank, uh, you can no longer be mayor. You know. I believe so, that uh, I believe a mayor would be above the sheriffs in terms of a power structure, so uh, yeah, yeah. They, they should watch themselves. Now, most of that, that they don't run in San Denis. Their base of operations ain't here. They're always in yeah. Valentine sitting yeah. on the porch more holding more each other's yeah. hands, blowing kissy nice. faces. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, land left at this rate. Do I have a story so to I tell heard. you, fellas? Let's hear it. So um, I bear witness firsthand of what happened to Mister Bean and Guama. Mr. Who? 
There was Mr. a Mr. Bean, currently George Hughes. Yes, apparently so, but I don't, I don't, I think they might just be brainwashing Bean. One George Hughes come back from Britain. I, I think, I think it's, I think, I, I think it's I, a shame or something. Yeah, I think it's a shame. Yes, <laughs> I remember, I remember it quite fondly. We were, me and Miss Bean were up at the old ruined church in Guama. You know, just enjoying the sights and sounds and smells of <laughs> of uh, Guama and uh, Smiley Joe and uh, Clive Freeman and another mice assailant that I can't remember came out of the bushes, pointed guns at us and kidnapped him. Oh, my God. That's horrible. Yes, Freeman didn't make it back to the mainland. He got shot and killed in Guama. Yeah, corrupt Clive long dead. Yep, yep, yep. And uh, and when I when I brought this up, when I when I brought this up uh, around the around Mr. Bean, aka George Hughes, aka actually Mr. Bean, uh, 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 Smiley Joe, and J Jack Goodman, the other marshal, were there, and they proceeded to ask to talk to me privately. During such, they handcuffed me. And beat me with an inch of my life. Hey, I heard that those gentlemen uh, might have done something to Mr. Squiz Taylor, dangling him off a mm. bridge or something as well. Yes, I, I did see that. They, they, uh, a few of the sheriffs pinned him down and shaved his head by the riverbank. They did that to me quite some like, Hey, Jumble! Well, not quite some time, yes. but recently How they, uh, they, they had me in San Denis and I was making fun of corrupt Clive. Yeah. They, uh, they shaved everything. It's grown back, grown back a bit. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it's when, not the way it when, was. When I was, um, anyway, <laughs> when I, I wasn't cooperating with them because fuck the pigs, <laughs> they uh, they decided to try and hog tie me and and take me out to the forest. This is when I thought my opportunity to escape when I ran through the streets of Valentine. Not the smartest idea, <laughs> but. Because I had all the ten sheriffs run after me, and they captured me, hogtied me, threw me on the back of of Jack Goodman's <laughs> mule, rolled me at Fort Wallace. When I was at Fort Wallace, they made me walk towards uh, Bucket Station, and quite clearly uh, uh, pointed out that this is the end of my trip in quotation marks. <laughs> if I don't change my memory about what happened and. And I shut up. About Holy shit! Horrible. What happened in Guam? Yes, yes. Evil bastards. And after quite scarily agreeing to this, they Nothing stripped me, the completely naked, and anyway. and said to tell people that if people ask why I'm naked, the forest the forest was calling me. That's horrible. <laughs> that, that sounds like some psychotic torture method. Yes. That's yes. horrible. And when I, Yes, and when I called for my horse and jumped on it and was riding away, they started shooting at me. They started shooting at you and your horse? Yes. It's horrible. I can't I can't support that. Yes. It's even more reason that we got to bring all these bastards down. We got to finish them. Yes, it's blatant fucking corruption. That's what it is. It is. Clive, wouldn't he, he might have had the title of corrupt Clive, but compared to some of them, he was an angel. <laughs> yes. Yes, uh, 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 Clive, Clive's uh, half of us now in the department, sadly. Yeah, I heard that. I heard that he jumped straight up to a uh, You know that last big something. storm? Mm. Favoritism. Right down on my house. It's, it again, more it corruption. Is more corruption, especially when it comes to the Freeman family and Freeman adjacents. Mm. Scum all of them, I tell you. Yes, I think I think the only thing that that's... That's where for the sheriff's department is a, it's a short rope and a short short drop. I'd say a short rope and a long drop. Oh hey, yeah, that's right. Or maybe a long rope and a short drop just so they break their legs. <laughs> <laughs> but no, we'll we'll stop and we'll 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 bring an end to all that corruption someday. <laughs> I tell you that much. Yes, yeah, so uh, quite reason. For that reason, though, I've uh, sorted out my uh, 
will just in case I end up dying. Now, let me just say this. I'm not suicidal at all, <laughs> nor do I want, I do not want to, want to die. So if I do die, just know. Richard Dome did not kill himself. I did Ugh. not kill myself. If Richard Dome is found dead alone in a prison cell, he did not do it. Yeah. Understandable. I, oh. Yes, I did not hang myself from the doorknob or something. Keep that in mind. We we, we know that for a fact. And, <laughs> and you got your will all sorted out. Mm. Even if they do it, at least something comes out of it. Mm. And if they do it, we'll know and we'll get our revenge. Mm. Scorched earth on those sons of bitches. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it might be beneficial if uh, the three of us and if Mr. Yeri ever makes his way back if we all do the same make some, some wheels or something just in case anything happens get, yes. a, get a lawyer involved or something and uh, make sure it's known better to be right. safe than sorry I like it I, I, don't I tell still can't Albert. Yes, I, I, I sure can't believe what happened. Well, she was stumbling how out of the room in the damn saloon last week. They're Times evil, I think. That after family, that, I guess. After that, see John Guamer and Mr. Freeman's death. Something mm. in them's just in the leadership's just right. snapped in there. Yes, yeah. they're all they're all crazy now. All power hungry. Hmm. I reckon it's. Uh, I reckon. We need to start taking names and cleansing out the department. Absolutely, mm. we gotta we gotta set up for this because you know we can sit here and talk all we want, but mm. unless we're planning actively and uh, I reckon scheming, it's not worth it. I reckon. Well, one thing I one thing I want to do is kidnap um George Hughes on a Wednesday night and bring him over to Guam. <laughs> that is a good plan. See if yeah. it sparks anything in his yeah. uh, <laughs> in his mind. Yeah. Right there's a stagecoach uh, And so then another right is uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> potentially <laughs> do some sort of bank robbery where we can get uh, one of the marshals as hostage and maybe execute him. I think that is a fine idea. I was going to yeah. say, who's the who's the top pig of the pile? I think. Uh, Smiley Joe is the truly rotten one here. What if we were to kidnap him one time and we put out a ransom? Man, man we could do something. If we, if we go for Marshall, Smiley Joe, but if I think we go for Sheriff, we should go for uh, that scumbag Zane Ryder. In, uh, yeah, certainly. It's definitely him. Definitely, definitely him. him. Definitely him, I think, and uh, maybe even uh, Mr. Bowman. If uh, yes. They do jumble, they do. Yes, Rain Rider's heavy anti-communism sentiment reeks. Oh, it's horrible. He's, dog. He's a he's a bourgeois pig, I reckon. I reckon his mama and papa probably made a bit too much money. Yes, man. I I think he definitely st smells of wealth, that man. He does, he does. Clearly never had a hard day of work in his life. He's got soft hands. Oh, trust. Oh, a lot of them have soft hands. You know why Mr. Lieutenant wears gloves lots of the time? Because he's got lady hands. I'll tell you that much. Yes, yes. yes Smooth he's, and supple. He's they, trying to hide him behind all that muscle. That is, the, that is the cold, hard truth of it all. They don't know what it's like to slave day in, day out, out in the desert, mining under the hot sun, just trying to make enough money to survive. They wouldn't have no. a clue. Speaking of that, I think we should unionize the mining sector and uh, yes. get yeah. some better worker protection because I've heard horrible stuff sometimes happening in those mines and they're, they're just dangerous. One time, mm -hmm. I was mining out in the desert and then out of nowhere, just this artillery bombardment all around me. I had to take cover in a tunnel and wait for it to stop just taking pot shots at me. And another time, I had troubles with my wagon i went to get help and when i come back someone had stolen a wheel it's How awful that's just not right See, that's that's why we need security running running the mines we need people this, with guns my god the folk damn wheel i know who like, steals a wheel <laughs> why why just the wheel why not the whole damn thing that's what i said what about the gemstones out the back of it or something why there's the nothing wheel? just my fucking wheel they just—they wanted you stranded out there because probably the bourgeois trying to 
trying to stop the little man from getting up in the world. That's right. I'm just trying to work. And yet I'm stealing my fucking wheels. It's not right. Not on. It's not on. <laughs> it's something deeply wrong with some folks. It's mentally unwell, mentally sick. We need to, uh, we need to send him to the, to the mental institutions. I heard those places work wonders Maybe on Maybe we could get Dr. Like Yuri to look at their head, see if they're all there. I Don't think it. it might be a good idea to get him to have a little peek behind the eyes. Lost cause, those wheel stealing son of a, sons of bitches. That should be that, that should be a death penalty right there, I'll tell you that much. Stealing a wheel? That's right. Exactly. You would have been stranded out there by the time you got back. Lucky I had some water left. Yeah, in the desert as well. They were trying to that 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 should be that should be attempted murder right in there, the I'll tell you what. Fucking desert. Just trying to work. It's not right, Voldemort. It's not right. It's, it's, it's just not right. But I think that's a good course of action if we uh, go for the mines at some point. I agree. Yeah, I reckon we could uh, unionize and 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 have protection in the mines. Exactly. See, I'm gl I'm glad that we are in an agreement here because uh, I know some folk might think that uh, you, my mine at the moment's more kind more of a free sect. You know, it's not really owned by anyone. Won't be enough land but, uh, left. I think it needs this, it needs there so needs to be better protections from the government, and uh, you know it's, it's hard hard work. And, and this 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 country wouldn't work without people in the mines. Where, where do you think where do you think the blacksmiths get all their all their materials from? Where do you think the guns get the, the guns the gunsmiths get all their stuff from? Uh, the, the, even even the even the fucking saloons need metal. Goddamn mm. stables need metal. Everyone needs metal, and without without the people working in the mines, we wouldn't have none of that. And they, they need to be treated treated so it's one of the better. I came across this nice lady one time out mining. And she was yo please do you, please sir do you have any emeralds? I need emeralds. I'll trade you whatever you want for some emeralds. It's just, it's, it was lucky I was there to supply her some emeralds. Poor thing. May I imagine what would have happened if she didn't get no emeralds. She could have, who knows what she needed him for, but she could, she could have died without him for all we so, know. That's right, man. Okay, there. What a horrid, uh, horrid fight that would be. Dying for a lack at, of emeralds. Especially out in the desert. <laughs> it's a bad way to go. Horrible way to go. Lost without a wheel. No emeralds to call your own. Ah, it's, just, it's not right. It's unconstitutional. Right. Not my America. Not my America. That's that's what I. That's what that should be our slogan. Capitalism, not in my America. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Well, this has been productive, gentlemen. I think this is where we uh, yes, we uh, call, can we call it? call it an evening here, and uh, we need to do some uh, some planning of our own. And uh, I think it might be imperative if we uh, cook up some more posters to uh, put around. Spare make the sure, people. Exactly. Make sure to make spares for uh, you know for Valentine, because someone there I don't want to name names. I got my suspicions, but someone there keeps taking them down quite swiftly, and uh. we need to be prepared to. Put them back mm, up. Yes. So tomorrow right. night, a new mayor of Saint Denis, and then Friday night, a new bank. future. Yeah. Two, two for one this week. I say the communists are making moves this time. Yes. Right. Yes. We're no longer. We'll show them the true power of it. No longer hiding in the shadows. Yes. It's time we bring all this stuff to the light. Perfect. Well, right. gentlemen, here, I'm gonna go. Uh, gonna go undercover oh. now. So uh, wish me luck. See if the bourgeoisie catch up to me or not. One last thing. Uh, oh, here we go. What's he gonna do? You gonna punch this loud mouth? Ain't I you? said, keep it down. God damn it! This guy, who he think he? What is? are you looking at? Standing up I'm in a chair. It's what you want, yeah, huh? Yeah, on the table. <laughs> Trying to disrupt our meeting, huh? Son of a bitch! Keep it down! 
Save the lady. Yeah. She's all right. She ain't done nothing. Get up! Oh, never mind. He's gonna kill the lady. Very unequal in communism. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Holy shit! Equal lefts and equal rights, you reckon? Yeah. Jesus! That'll Come show him. Right here. Stay alert. <laughs> what are the yeah, emeralds for, Rando? Hmm. Bloody bunch of bastards! Probably stole oh my, my wheel. God. All right. That seems seems we dealt with that. They might have been bourgeoisie spies. They couldn't leave the room. They heard. Yes, much. yes, that's right. That's right. Uh, this way. Well, gentlemen. All right, everyone. Imagine we come out the door and it's just sheriffs everywhere. Likewise. Until next time, my friends. Good luck with the election. And if I don't see you, you before you. Friday hopefully night. I'll, uh, hopefully we have good news. I look forward to it. Too funny. Too funny. Alright, well, there you go. So, so while I'll be on as George Hughes tomorrow night, the the mayoral election of St. Denis will be taking place. And then, so it's Friday night. I'll be back on as Valdemar. Doing a bank heist. Let's go. That'd be fun. Part of the recipe for the bars used to upgrade the pickaxes. Well, one of the bars. Ah! I see. I see, I see. Right. Oh, it's been a hell of a journey, Jumble. That'll be fun. Okay, so yeah, George Hughes tomorrow night. Valdemar, Communist Party... Bank robbery, Friday night, let's go. Hell yeah, that'd be good. Keen for that. It's gonna be a good time. <laughs> it was, everyone's equally communism bank. <laughs> Oh dear. Too good. Too good. It does sound like a metal album. Oh my god. Oh my god, you too too true, Jumble. <laughs> oh, good stuff. Alright, well that's exciting. That is very exciting. Hopefully Dopey Dill's free. And that's great to hear that Vance is good at cracking the safe. Because, yeah, I could... I I haven't been able to do it. Alright. Well, I won't, I won't stop as Valdemar just yet. Am I smaller? Have I become shorter? Or has the horse gotten bigger? Can't get on the horse. Oh no. Oh. Ah! Well, it is a long weekend, so he might be alright. But what time does he finish at night time? I can't get back on my horse. Alright, let's go to the stable. Where's the stable again? Oh dear. What's happened there? It's over here, isn't it? Wait. Yeah, straight down. Yeah, 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 yeah. I should get my way around. That's right. We have a... We've got a secret... A secret Communist Party channel in a Discord. 
and we'll um we'll hit him up. Be like, yo. You good for Friday night, mate? For a communist party bank robbery? Let's fucking go. The only thing I regret is I have boneiters. What's osteoporosis again? Come here, horse. You damn horse! Oh, yes, 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 yes. That's right. Well, I think it's been a while since we've hunted down a player as Valdemar, so let's, um... Let's pop through the towns and let's see if we can find someone. Valdemar needs some blood. He needs... NPC blood only goes so far. Valdemar needs some player blood. Let's see what we let's see what we can find, eh? Another successful Communist Party meeting. Very productive. I love the, like, delusion. Like, yeah, we can bring down the... We can bring down the, the sheriff's department and that. It's like, it's so optimistic. It's so great. Like, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna bring it all down. Like, it's so good. <laughs> and I just love, it, like, every time there's always something that funny that happens around the time of the meetings. It's like, you know, we're here for the working class. We're here for the work, the, you know, the the everyday man, you know, unionize the miners and that. What do we do? Murder a bunch of people in a saloon. <laughs> All that other time, we're like, down with the bourgeoisie, and here we are meeting in a mansion. It's so good, dude. The humor is, I love it. Oh fuck me! Oh god! I'm not risking it. Last time we got I got attacked by wolves as Valdemar. I got messed up. All right. Born to bite, forced to suck. Forced to drink iced coffee this morning. It's not in the same as first coffee in the morning. Aww. Sorry to hear that jumble. Hang in there. Also, the, um, the Phenoms tried your, um, uh, tater tot hot pot recipe. Um, um, can someone clip this, please? What? What the fuck are you doing in here? No, please! Oh, God! Okay, no. Nah. I don't think it can die. It's the character motivation! It's not me! It's the character! It's the character! Morning, friend.
<laughs> Fluffy? It's alright, Fluffy's okay. Fluffy is okay. Fuck! Oh my god. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Fluffy. It's the character, it's not me, it's the character! I promise! Well, I came across a sheep. I tried to kill it, but it's very strong. And a very good morning to you. It's a very strong sheep. <laughs> Sir, good morning. <laughs> Bet everyone's up in Valentine. Chatterbox son of a bitch kept pestering me while I drank, so I knocked his teeth out. Who knew about that? <gasps> oh no, skeletons! What's Myers been doing? Uh oh. Myers has turned dark side. Oh no! Oh! Exciting. Oh no, I failed the... I failed the rescue mission. Oh, hello. Who have we here? Good day.
Good day. Good day. Uh. <laughs> There's a vampire in there. <laughs> Excuse me? What? Uh oh. What did you say? That's racist. Blatant racism. You should be ashamed of yourself. I'm Transylvanian. Oh, lucky they're, lucky they're riding around in a pair. <laughs> lucky they lucky lucky they were riding together and they had their guns drawn. She's like there's a vampire in there. Just straight up. Very lucky they were together. We'll go to Valentine's, see if we can, maybe we can, maybe we can snag Squiz Taylor or something. <laughs> I'm not a vampire, I'm Transylvanian. There's a difference. It's racist. Bourgeoisie pigs. <laughs> Oh boy, my horse has uh, got maximum bonding now. Don't you crash into me, dear. <laughs> Haven't seen any lawmen tonight. Well, have spent most of the night in a secret underground saloon, so... That probably answers my my thought there. You know who we might be able to find? Who's always um, up for donating blood? Willie Jones. We might see him in Valentine. <laughs> he might be our little blood bag tonight. <laughs> you vote Sage, you get better gun upgrades. That's great. A 
local running out of Valentine? Unheard of. Dun dun. If only like a black cloud could follow me. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, there's the woman. <laughs> I think that's What's, what's Clive Freeman's brother's name? Billy Burns or something? I think that's Lieutenant. Yeah, you take a good look with your binoculars, eh? Take a good look. There's only two of them. There is only two of them. The hell is happening there? Who's that? <laughs> Thank you. 
Or maybe Jumble. Maybe. What do I need for it, apart from the um, potato gems? What else do I need? How you going, sir? Good, yourself? Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. How's your day been? Oh, it's been very productive. What about yours? Oh, yeah, mine's been very quiet. I've only just not long put the train in, you know. Come in to see how it's going. Oh, yes. See how my sweet town of Valentine is. What are your plans for today? Uh, my plans for today is probably go some mining if I don't get robbed and, uh, and you know, and kidnapped again like I always do. So yeah, apart from that, um, yeah, we go mining so I can get uh, some supplies ready for blacksmithing. Oh, very good to hear. Very good to hear. Where do you usually go mining? Um, well, I normally go up to Mount Shan. There's a mine up there. Or I go to the, the Diablo mine. Or I've been going to Alyssa Pools late, as of late because it's hidden in the waterfall so no one can really find me to rob me. So. Oh, yes. I've heard very good things about that one. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one up there. And hello, Mr. Myers. Hey, Eddie Blair, I haven't seen you in a while. Yes, I've been busy mining myself. You know, working hard, go to work hard for the money. Yeah, we're all working hard. I worked hard enough to get a new house. Oh, where's your new house? Um, oh, right I don't really yeah. want to share that just yet. That's fair. Oh, what the hell is... Oh! Oh, my God. Look out! Someone's shooting! Yeah. What really the hell? He's been being a pain in the ass lately, so... What's he been doing? He's been leaving rat shit everywhere in my saloon and in the gunsmith's, as well as shooting up arrows in the gunsmith's. Oh, my God. Silly Willy. Yep. Silly Willy. What's going on out here? Well, where'd he go? What's going on out here? Ah! Valdemar. Oh, oh my Jesus. God! Oh wow, the 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 man knocked you down. Some uh, man, he just punched uh, Willie uh, in the uh, head. Uh, oh my Willie. God! Woodman, pack your damn horse away now. Is I'm gonna. The yeah, the mayor's gonna get a bullet to the head. <laughs> Don't shoot the mayor, mayor. <laughs> uh, Mr. Valdemar, you were, uh, you, you said before you're a doctor. Uh, medically trained. Okay, um, oh jeez, one second. Oh no, you're right, mate. does he need medical attention? No, now he's I need two not right. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna need, Mr. Valdemar, come with me, please. Yo, Chef Snow, well, um, unfortunately, because it's modded, it's only available right, on mate? PC, I'm afraid. And I put a but damn bullet in Woodman's The next GTA horse. will hopefully bring this sort of thing to console. All right, let me rest you on the bed here, mate. Oh my, what the f... You're having a bit of a bad day. I've got you perfect. Oh, well, this gentleman decided to run away from us when we wanted to ask him questions and jumped off a cliff. Oh. Now, yeah, I don't know why. We just wanted to have a chat. Do you need me to try and revive the two of them? Well... <laughs> Can I get you to look at Mr. Burns, please, while I continue with this gentleman here? Yes, please. but I will... Uh, you know, privacy would be better so I could concentrate. I can't do that. Actually, never mind. The doctor's here. Oh. Um, all right, Mr. Loris. Uh, oh, got here. Can we get Mr. Burns up first? So this gentleman decided to jump off a cliff while we wanted to, like, while we wanted to talk <laughs> to him. Uh, this man, uh, Mr. Burns, he was kicked by Woodman's damn horse. Right. Okay. Oh, well. Okay. Um, this gentleman had a dislocated elbow. Uh, myself, oh, and, right. myself and Burns popped it back into place while he was unconscious. 
Um, could we get maybe Burns up first just so we can... Uh, yeah, sure. This gentleman just kicked, kicked by in the oh, chest, I see. Yeah, really. All right, I'm just going to unbutton your... Uh, oh, this might be a good opportunity so for me shirt. to see how the American doctors work. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, a bit of bruising there. That's going to hurt for a while. All right, just excuse my uh, cold hands. I just got off my horse. I'm just going to feel ever so slightly on your chest to feel if there's any of those ribs are broken. So, oh, it hurts. Yeah, I know. So, got to make sure nothing's broken. Oh. All right, sorry. I know it's uncomfortable, but I really need to feel those ribs. <laughs> All right. Nothing major. I can't feel anything that's obviously broken. It could be fractured, but nothing broke, broke. <laughs> All right. I know it's painful. I will give you some aspirin for the pain in a second. Um, All right. Your chest is going to be very, very bruised. So what I'm going to do... So I'm going to rub some arnica gel on this. Um, arnica will help bring the swelling, uh, bring the bruising out, and this and help the swelling. It'll feel nice and cool on your skin as well. So let me just uh, grab that out from my uh, pocket here, and just start to feel some cool sensation on your chest, and that'll hopefully help. Don't mind the smell. It's really good for you. I, I can assure you this will help. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes things are good for you, but they don't always uh, smell or taste right. No. Did the doctor just Damn rub it. manure on me? Because it stinks. Uh, no, you got kicked by Woodman's horse. You're going to realize that Woodman and his horse are a massive pain in the ass. Damn, shoot that horse. I'll shoot it in the head, don't worry. All right. What I am going to do is uh, it's really helpful when you've got this kind of bruising and damage on your chest that we strap you up pretty uh, heavily uh, to restrict the movement because you are going to feel this for quite a while. I'd say the next uh, next few days are going to be really, really tough on you. Your breathing is going to be a little bit heavy uh, whilst your uh, body repairs the damage of that nice little horse kick to the chest. So I'm going to go in now with some... Uh, Quite a bit of a uh, few lengths of cotton and you're going to feel quite restricted. This will be tight, um, but we need to make it nice and tight. And try not running anywhere if possible. Make Lou do all the running. That's all right. We're running through a lot of training at the moment. All right, sorry, I do need to get underneath here with this bandage. A little bit of manhandling. And Woodman's got a uh, got a, quite a big horse too, so that was a mighty big kick, I can imagine. Mm-hmm. Uh, kick me once and then it come back. Kick me again. All right, I'll just tie this off. Now, just pop a little uh, paper package of aspirin powder in here. Just mix that with some water every time you feel a little bit of pain and have a drink of that. <laughs> there you go, sir. Have a seat, drink some water, and let that morphine get through your system. All right, so we uh, you popped his elbow it. back in. Yeah, I believe he's starting to wake up. All right, no problem. Let's have a look at his eyes. It's quite the uh, uh, quite the garish outfit we got happening here, don't we? Well, he seems to be. Uh, Why are you looking at me like that? Just making sure you're all right. <laughs> I'm sure what? Do you feel good? I, I feel better. Good. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? No. You don't like my bedside manner? I think he manners? might have some mild concussion, but he seems to be okay. His pulse seems to be steady I, since he's I been laying like... here. Yep. Uh, yeah. The like elbow you know, looks good. Off. You seem fit as a fiddle. Seems to be doing all right, Lou. For, uh, how far did you say he fell? Uh, he jumped off a, a proper cliff. 
like a uh, decently sized cliff. Yeah, that's all he's got, and that's pretty damn good. Let's fill his legs. Yeah. Well, we've popped his arm back in. Yeah. Now yeah, we've got a close oh, check leg. Any damage to the legs? All right, Burns, do you want to get your gun out for me, please, mate? Yeah, yeah I think this gentleman's very, very, very lucky. Yeah, we really? he took oh. quite the fall. Yeah. Just wanted to have a chat with him. That elbow's going to be fine. Sorry, sir, I'm just going to move your arm around. I just wanted to see what movement you got. <laughs> I mean, he is laughing. Yeah, all right. Well, I'd just say he's got a bit of a concussion. That elbow's going to be right. So uh, we'll get him on his feet now if you want to get ready. Yep. Stand back, Mr. Vanima, please, sir. Uh... Uh, sir, once you get on your feet, I want you to put your hands up, please. Do you have handcuffs on you, Mr. Luke? I believe I you do, gave mate. me yours. Yeah, okay. On. Oh, uh, yeah, I do. <laughs> put your hands up, please, mate. I face the wall. Quite an impressive fall you did. I'm not surprised. Sheriffs always were the crazy ones. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? All right, come with me. Who the fuck is this? Over here. <laughs> Sorry to run away. We just wanted to have, we wanted to have a chat with you, mate. Yo, Jago. Ricky, hmm, what could you possibly talk to me about? Hmm? Firstly, to why you were sneaking around the outskirts of Valentine with your binoculars. Why, to watch entertainment, of course. Gunshots, all sorts of things. Can't risk one's safety. Or madness, for that matter. <laughs> <laughs> now, yeah, who's, who really plays this guy? You decided to run away. I wanted to see how well you can chase. The last lot didn't do so well. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Are you okay, sir? Oh, I'm peachy. <laughs> that doctor makes my mouth water. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> right. Is that doctor still around, actually? Give me two seconds, Lou. I Maybe think uh, a psych evaluation might be needed on this I man. I think so as well. Oh, I, I've been medically trained. I can, I can do it. You can do psych evaluation, sir. Yes. If you wouldn't mind doing one on this on this man here, that'd be. Uh, of course. Terrific. Get have, Dolores. Have you put well. my? Uh... Get Dolores. All right, hold on. Oh no, no, I work better alone. Well, uh, we'll, let, we'll let you have him after we're done, Mister Verma. You can chat to him. I don't want to chat to him. I wanted to do a psych analysis. Mm. Liver, Chris, good lungs. Uh, I'm not sure, Mr. Mm. Your opinion. body parts might be useful. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Doris, we think this man might not be right in the head. Okay, uh, has he spoken any words? He said the doctor makes his mouth water, then he just started talking about body parts and body parts being useful and he wanted to go for a chase or something because the other department didn't do too well i think he's he's a bit i think he's had he's I think he's knocked his head around too much well he's probably suffering from a bit of concussion um all right when, when you we'll just ignore I the doctor you, my noggin is nothing more than fine <laughs> okay all right so we have a very uh interesting mannerisms there um do you have a name, sir? Can we establish a name? Ricky the Immortal Wilson. <laughs> Ricky Immortal Wilson. Mr. Wilson, do you want to stand up against that wall for me real quick? Mm, very well. And face up, please. <laughs> so you can continue, Mr. Loris. Um So what do you what do you do for a living? Ricky. Oh. Who needs to be living when you can just borrow others' lives? Oh, okay. oh my god. I mean, I borrowed this body. <laughs> okay, uh, what do you mean by borrowed? 
Needed something younger, more youthful. Old one useless. Mr. Potter, I will find. Okay. <laughs> mm so, um, did you... Mr. Yes, Potter, he is you know you know me. Uh, okay. I, think I, I think I believe I met Mr. Potter the other day. Okay. Did you um, say your... Sorry, just to step in real quick. Did you say your last name was Wilson or Williams? Wilson. Thank you. Continue. Um, now, when you say you... you that's not your body. Did you steal it off someone? How did you oh, get a body? That, that, that. Hmm. I'm not sure who it was before, but it was useful either way. Okay. Uh, did you just find it on the side of the road? Did you dig it up from somewhere? or you just? Oh, don't be stupid. Kidnapped the person and took him over. How else do, does something like me move from host to host? <laughs> oh, this is fun. I like you people. Uh, I'm so bad for you. <laughs> How old are you, uh, Mr. Wilson? Mm. Well, this one's probably only about 18, but I myself would be roughly around 90. Well, well there's indeed an outstanding... Uh body you managed to uh steal there granny rags made me better than normal made me superior in every way lovely witch <laughs> a witch okay and wh where does uh where does one find this witch hmm. here there anywhere she comes and goes all right well, that's very interesting. I'd like to hear more about this uh, oh, body stealing. Oh, I you with me around. Your county's never going to be the same again. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Turn around for me, Mr. Williams. Williams? A quick search. Oh, Wilson, sorry. <laughs> very well. Don't mind the bones. They were my old body. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> But you can have them. I don't have much use for those anymore. If they, I'm not touching your old body bones. <laughs> oh, I can't get back. I can't get back into his pockets anyway. All right, I'll take those lock picks off you. All right, Mr. Wilson, you're going to be charged twenty dollar fine for evasion, and you're going to be getting a. You're going to get five community service actions today. Um, Mr. Valdemar, after he does his five community service actions, you're free to. Talk to him. Give him an evaluation of your own. All right, Mr. Wilson, turn around. I, I, I like you, gentlemen. Let the games begin. What sort of games? The one where people go missing. <laughs> oh, God. I've got enough people missing at the moment. Oh, I'm going to make it a mountain of missing folk. Just wait. Fun and games. Are you related oh, to you, Are you related to Dusty by any chance? Hmm. Who knows who this poor sod was related to before I took him over? <laughs> yeah, I feel like this guy's related to Dusty. All right, put your hands. I want to uncuff you, sir. I want you to put your hands up for me. Oh, very Mr. well. Mr. Burns, uh, do you want to reach for your weapon? Thank you, sir. But you should be more worried about who's been shooting at you. And me? Oh no, that's too low. I prefer up close and personal. <laughs> Toodaloo. What the fuck was that? I don't know. What the it's hell, man? Stuff. Where did you get him from? I was at the bottom of we the cliff. Were, yeah, we were talking to, uh, to Woodman, and then we heard a couple of shots. Because we actually, no, we were talking to Ingo Patch. And then we came down to, to see if Woodman was shooting. And I seen this gentleman, or well, I wouldn't call him a gentleman, I seen this crazy man crawling around the uh, outskirts of uh, Valentine. So I walked up to him, like, department, you know, can we help you? And he decided to run. And then he 
legged it straight for the cliff and jumped off. We just wanted to have a talk to him. That's it. Why is it that Valentine is the centre for all the crazies? I don't know, Dolores. It's... I don't know. You know, they say Valentine's a town of mud and morons. Oh, more than morons. I think there's some very uh, deeply disturbed individuals. I think so. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the mud. Maybe it's something in Valentine. I don't know, but that man's crazy. As soon as people uh, step into Valentine. I don't Valentine... believe we've met. Yeah, oh, Miss Dolores. Uh, I just know her name was Dolores because you told me to get um, Dolores. So this is uh, Bill Burns. He's the uh, younger brother of the late Clive Freeman. Oh, nice to meet you, and uh, my condolences for Something. your brother. Thank you, thank you. And uh, this is Lord Valdemar. Shame oh, we couldn't oh. meet on uh, yeah. better, better terms. Three oh, Mr. Mr. Vlad Vladimir and I have met a few times. Yeah, uh, I brought him in because I, he told me before he had some medical training, so I was getting him to help me. Mm. Yes, yeah. I still am meaning to have a talk to you, Mr. Vladimir. I'm quite interested in these uh, blood drives you keep wanting to have. Oh, they've been very successful and, you know, keeps the blood pumping through the fine folk of saint Denis. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, quite concerned about how you store this blood and what it's used for, because I haven't seen a drop of it. I don't store it. It goes straight to the nice man at the desk at the doctor's office in saint Denis. Hmm. All right. Okay. I believe something about a cellar and ice or something like that. Nice and cool. Yes, it's interesting. It's interesting that I don't know about this facility. I might have to uh, look into this a bit further because, as I said, didn't uh, nothing, none of that was sanctioned through the medical board. Oh no! Here, look, come here. I have the documentation for you. Hello. Uh, how do I see it again? I think of uh, slash something. Uh, you want to think about document. Oh. There you are. Oh, surprise, surprise, Mr. Yuri. Yes, the fine Dr. Yuri. Hmm. Yes, you I'd see, like to find Mr. Yuri right now. I would like to also speak to Mr. Yuri as well. If Me you too. Tell him uh, I would like to talk to him. Yes. Do you know the, where uh, he is? Is this Mr. Yuri live? Yuri. Yeah. Do we know where Mr. Yuri is? Is he still missing? Because he's he's sort apparently, of gone from his job. Apparently he's dead. Oh. Apparently. Oh no. Um. But I'm gonna put him down as a missing person in a in a couple of days, if I don't hear from him. Right, well, uh, unless we see a body, he's still very much alive. And if he doesn't get his butt back to work, he'll be fired soon. Exactly. <laughs> well, until uh, then, I'm going to put him as missing and not deceased. All right. Um, yeah, there's a bit more to this. I can't en enclose at the moment. Uh, yes. It's part of an ongoing investigation. It's okay. Uh, I uh, met someone the other day who was... Uh... A little chat to me, pulled me aside and had a little chat to me and gave me some concerning information. So I'd very much like to talk to Yuri myself. All right. Well, if you'd like to share that information with me a little later, Mr. Lawrence, I'd be happy yeah. to take yes. some notes. It would be a off the record private conversation because yeah, yeah, I right. uh, don't want this individual to uh, get any no, trouble. No, 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 that's fine. At the end of the day, um, yeah, we're doing a bit of an investigation at the moment. There are a couple of people missing. Mm, I've noticed. What happened to my friend? Where is he? He's technically missing or maybe presumed dead, Mr. Valdemar. Oh, you must find him. Poor Yuri. Uh, I personally believe he'll be fine, but um, yeah. If, if anyone does see Mr. Yuri, I'd like to have a chat with him. If anyone does see him, please tell him to hand himself in the department so he can uh, clear up his missing persons, you know? We've had way too many people being kidnapped lately. Well, yeah, you better get concerning. out there, find him. Yep. We are, we are. Uh, we we, we have leads. people looking. Don't worry. We have leads. Oh, there's just a lot going on at the moment, but uh, yeah, we, we're getting we're getting to it. All right, gentlemen, to go do some reports. I'll leave you to it. No problem. Thank you again. I'll catch up with you a bit later, Lou.
Nice no, to meet you. Lewis. Yeah, nice to meet you, Bill. Hopefully, I'll uh, get to chat better. Yeah, hopefully, yeah, under better circumstances. Yep. All right. Nice to meet you as well, Mr. Mr. Vla Vladimir. Lord Leinhardt Valdemar. Valdemar, that's the one. There Sorry, that's know. my fault. I keep calling you Valdemir. It's fine. Or Valdemar. It's fine. It's fine. Poor Yuri. Where, Yuri? Hello. Good evening. How's it going, Val? Oh, hello. What was your name again? Uh, Woodman. Oh, hello, Woodman. It's going all right, but I'm... <laughs> I'm so concerned for my lost friend. Who's that? It wasn't the clown, was it? Yuri. Hey, Yuri's, Yuri's fine. Where is he? Oh, yeah, he's here like most nights. Uh, is he? He's, he's dressing up as some Victor Smirnoff fellow. Where is he? Show me know. him. Show uh, me my friend. Not... I don't think he's around at the moment. I haven't seen him, but he, he's put on some weight and he's cut all of his hair off. And he has an eye patch. What? Yeah. Well, if you see him before I do, you tell him that Valdemar says hellos. Okay, I'll say Val said hello, all right. Thank you. Thank you, Woodman. It's all right. Oh. What a silly place. Oh, Yuri. He must be so scared. Right now, he seems to be laughing a lot at the moment with his big belly. What has he been eating to get so big? I don't know. I know, and he, he keeps saying they're after him, and I'm like, who? And he won't say. Who's after him? I Ooh. don't know. He just said they. I don't know who's they? after him. Yeah. What, what are they doing? <laughs> I, I don't know what they're doing. That's the thing, yeah. We well, must so, find out. It's not right. Yeah, he seems to be scared of, uh, of someone or something. Oh, dear. Who's this? Who's this man in the stripes? Oh, yeah, it's the clown man. The clown man? I know, he keeps laughing like a clown. How exciting. No, it's good to be... It's good to laugh. Laughter is the best medicine, as they say, back in, back home in Transylvania. You know, just about any ailment, just laugh it off. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! There you go. And everything will be all right. You haven't seen Mr. Willie Jones around, have you? No, I was looking for him as well, but no sign. Yeah, he keeps putting rat shit everywhere. Where, where's he getting the rat shit? Oh, from the bin. Oh man, there's some heaps of shit in that gun store. Willie? No, I'm Steven. Hello, Bullshit. Steven. Bullshit. I'm, I'm Steven. Good, good evening, Steven. What was your name? Who, me or him? Not, not the man with the gun. Uh, lord Leinhardt Valdemar. Nice to meet you, my lord. Nice to meet God you too, damn it, Stephen. Willy. This isn't Willy. Yeah, it's a fake beard. Is oh, it? It's, it's Stephen. He's uh -huh. clearly named Stephen. Now, I, wait, hold up a second. <laughs> yeah, and he's got the fake eyebrows. It's Willy. What? What? <laughs> Well, if they're fake, really? give them a bit of a tug. Yeah, yeah, the, the the witch lady put the fake eyebrows on for him. You can spot him a mile away, because he, uh, look, he always looks cross. What he's a real. Lady? Give him a tug. Oh, I'll tie you up and get you fingerprinted by the lawman, and then they'll be able to tell. Why would you tie up Stephen? He's done nothing. On suspicion of being Willie. <laughs> Who is Willie? Mr. Vladimir. Yes? Um, uh, my friend over here would like to introduce himself. Oh, of course, Mr. Laughing Man. I'm on to you, Willie. Good evening, Mr. Mr. Clown, is it? Mikey Wilson. Nice to meet you, Mr. Wilson. My name is Lord Leinhardt Valdemar. How are you this evening? Oh, I'm doing peachy. <laughs> Master trick a stupid sheriff to run off a cliff. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> we, did you get to take a photo? Oh, no, no. He managed to get up. Still hurt, though. Me, on the other hand, you don't feel pain after a few body swaps. Although they've got some nice parts I could use. <laughs> oh, that's a good way of looking at it. Oh, it would... That's a nice trick. I would have loved to see it. See them topple down. Oh, mm, yes. pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna be heading to the saloon, Ricky, so you keep care of yourself. Oh, very good. Take care, Mr. Arthur. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they didn't want the bones. I offered to give it to them. <laughs> it's a nice gift. It's very thoughtful. Lasts a long time. But they don't seem to like it. Oh, but I like them. The only... Unlike the others, they weren't very bright. The only thing they like to do is they like to show off and they like to march through saint Denis with their big iron horse and shoot out the place and bully everyone. Oh, lovely city. Too bad, unfortunately, it has things like that in it. It's a damn shame. Oh. Look at this. This man, he's accused of being a willy. And now what? They're marching him off to shoot him or something. Of course. All lawmen replace their heart with a badge. Me, I just replace it with another heart. <laughs> Excuse me, my lord. Could you tell them that I'm Stephen? Well, this this man is Stephen. Well, does Stephen have any and idea? I'm the president of the United States of America. Oh, good. Yeah. Oh, nice Get to meet to you. Get to the train right. station now. Let's go. Start I feel walking. like I'm being harassed. Start my lord, walking. am I being harassed? Start walking. Leave this man alone. He's done we nothing just, wrong. We just want to see his ID. Why? What has he done wrong? What have I done wrong? The face thing. Uh, anything wrong? Yeah, well, it it's a matter. crime. It's a crime. Day, it doesn't not matter. To, not to supply your ID when asked. Let's go, Mr. Steven, to the to the uh, train station. Let's go. I'll take the fine. Five dollars <laughs> is it? No, it's a lot more than five dollars. It's more than the. Uh, Six dollars. This is the last time, or we're going to be uh, arresting you. I'll take the fine. I seven dollars. That's we... fine. We can just no! fingerprint him. Mr. Steven. Oh, this feels like harassment. Yeah. Police you know brutality. Harassment? You know what else is harassment? No, Police brutality. You know what we else is harassment? This is ID. Seem so now to appreciate you know, people's will. Yep, that's fine. Once you get your law department badge, mm. then we can. Uh, Steven! How stay strong! When I get it off Somebody your body. call a lawyer! <laughs> call Victor! Call Victor? I told you, hey, walking Mr. Yuri's also a lawyer now. I, I feel so powerless. What can we do against such brute force? Oh, play it at their own game. Wow! Play it another way. As Granny Rags, my lovely witch, would say, curse their ass to the ends of the earth. <laughs> That's all well and good, but how do we do that? Hmm, locks of hair, some blood samples, anything, as long as it's off their person. But they've locked Little the door. Bit of voodoo. <laughs> they've locked the door. Oh, they do that all the time. Who's. <laughs> They're willing to chase me off a cliff, but won't even leave a door unlocked. Interesting. What if... Could you lead them to another cliff right now? And then I could sneak in and save Mr. Steven. Oh, I think they'd be expecting me to do something. Oh, yes. That have eyes in the backs of their heads. Well, all I was doing was watching the chaos with binoculars. Decide to play tag with them and they don't like it too much. Hmm. Might have to find a bigger cliff for them to chase me off of next time. It's it did to go bigger and larger than last time. Oh, I enjoy things like chasing them off of the brandy wine drop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. Steven, I only just got to know him too. We may never see him leave that building. Oh, such a pity. 
Mr. Woodman, does this usually happen here? Oh, all the time. All the time. All the time. Oh yeah, yeah. They're not too happy at the moment. They think that's Mr. Willie who defaced a uh, uh, a passed on sheriff's uh, gravestone. So that's why they're really pissed off today. Oh. They, where's the proof? Uh, the the Willie's putting. Well, Willie taught him himself in a in a letter. He sent him a letter saying, "Hey, I put shit on the uh, on Freeman's grave." So he dobbed himself in. Why? Mm. Why would he? What? Oh, there's Where's another this? one. Okay. Oh, it's quick. Oops, more people coming down here. What is this? More lawmen. So, oh, Mr. Wood, what are you exactly? If your name is Wood, were you made from a tree? No, I'm a hunt. Uh, you, what the hell was that? There's a half a man on the horse. Oh my god. Interesting. I'm not the only supernatural thing around, it seems. <laughs> hey, that was, that was something. Uh, yeah, no, I used to be, be a hunter. I was a woodman. But, oh, uh, but these, these days, I'm a, I'm a gunsmith. Hmm. A body. Look at this poor man, dazed and confused. He's probably been beaten half to death by the lawman. Indeed, indeed. What are they doing to him in there? All kinds of unspeakable things. Wait, here comes one. Help, my lord, help. Help, Stephen. Willie! Stephen! Uh, I don't know. He hasn't responded to my telegram. Please yet. help me. Stephen! I'm being wrongfully detained. Stephen, just, just go to your happy little. place! Get back in, get back the, in cell. the cell. Go to yeah. your happy place, Stephen! He's going to his happy place. Don't let him Blind break bar. you! Get away from the department, please, get in. Don't give in, Mr. Stephen! Get in. The people Get about away, died are with door. you! No, they're not. Valdemar! My lord! Stay strong! Believe in yourself! Valdemar! Rescue me, my lord! There's no need to feel sorry for this criminal. I can't! They have Stop. a force field active on the door! Yeah, that's what it is. A force field. Its magic is too strong! Just come in, Mr. Valdemar. Some would say we have a cross above the door. Yeah. Where's the window? Steve! My lord! Are you okay? Get me out of here and I'll donate as much blood as you want. I can't. I, I can't get in. Start a riot in the streets. Yeah. Yeah, start a riot in the streets. See what's going to happen. Shut up, you. <laughs> My lord. Yes. Yes. What? Please. I will. Do anything you can. Steve, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe murder the wooded man over there and get me out. That's, that might be a little extreme. Gentlemen, long arms off your back, please. Everybody, long arm off your back. Thank you very Can much. You break a window or something. Hold on. They're all locked. Go away. <laughs> Vatima, this is your final warning. Move away from the department building. He's done nothing wrong. You have three seconds. He's One. done he nothing wrong. You make me come out there, I'm going to arrest you for being an accomplice. Exactly. I have done no accomplicing. I'm trying to reassure a friend that everything's going to be all right. Two. Who are you, white hat? <laughs> You okay? Oh, no. His suits are ruined. <laughs> they won't let him go. They were threatening to. Sh oh my oh. God! Jesus Christ! Sorry, there was mate. Not even a sound from no, that one. All right. Where the hell did my hat go? They won't let him go. I fear they may kill him. 
Mr. Steven uh, is very scared. But I can't get him. Have you tried suggesting that you pay the the fines yourself for him? He's offered to pay them at least six dollars, but they won't have it. Oh my God, Woodman! 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 Oh, I tripped. Just more police brutality. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> police brutality, but indirectly police brutality. He's oh, well, it is because, you know, the stairs. He's anyone. Long arm off your backs, please. Uh, say again, sorry. What if we banded together when they open the door? We rush them. <laughs> That sounds fun. <laughs> I technically can't do that since I live here. Oh. Wow. What about you, Woodman? Are you going to just stand here and let this happen? Oh, I'm, I'm just I'm just a village gunsmith. Mind you, yeah, there are same as me. There are more of um, you than them. I'm sure you could be a marshal if you wanted. Marshal. Isn't that the highest policeman? Oh, it is. Oh, wait, no, it's two more of them there. Hey, Harkness! They're multiplying. Harkness! Oh, do you know it's a breeding ground? <laughs> or they ignored me. I believe they're ignoring you, sir. Well, it takes four men to... They tend to do to... that, Mr. Woodsman. Four men yeah. to beat Steven. <laughs> yeah, they're, doing, they're doing something nasty to him in there. <laughs> what is that? Hmm. A half naked man running down there. Oh. Oh my uh. goodness. Why the hell did they confiscate my binoculars? They took your binoculars? I just realized they took my binoculars. I think they're supposed to give them back to you. No. They took my but I don't know why the hell you would take a binoculars off of someone. What do they think I'm gonna do? Stare them to death? Not a bad idea. Uh, who knows? I possibly just don't want anyone to see them ahead of time. Oh, would you look at that? I ma managed to magic them back. I'm neutral with the lawman mostly because of the uh, my partner being a part of it. So, what the hell is that guy? Is that a native? Yeah, it's a native, local native. Don't don't worry about him. No, I enjoy eating them. They're crunchy. Oh my god! Don't eat him. Why not? Even though I don't quite know him personally, he's been around in Valentine for a little while. I told the sheriffs that the games begin. Things tend to go missing when I'm around. Usually people. Yeah, so it doesn't sound too good there. What's... I think you're covered in mud. Yeah. What did I you am. find out? <laughs> Do you think uh, he, he, he put 23 pieces of rat shit on the, uh, on the sheriff's grave. Holy shit. I... This does not look good. Hello. <laughs> Eight days ago, as the sheriff by himself in the doctor's surgery. What the oh. fuck is that? What, what, what is, is that? happening? Something was that happened. inside? Yeah. Was it? Was that inside the? the Steven? Steven! Everyone back away from the building. What did happen to Steven? They didn't just execute him, did they? I don't know. Did you shoot him? 
I wasn't in there. I don't know, but I see everyone running out. Woodman, put your fucking gun away. And your knife. And your knife. Thank you. What were but those shots? I don't know. Let me check the saloon and see if that came Nothing you uh, lovely civilians of uh, Valentine need to worry about. Move on, please. Thank you. Go about your day. This is a police yeah. brutality thing? Now, if it's br police brutality, we wouldn't do it here and you wouldn't hear it. Can, can we can we talk to Steven? Uh, no. When he's finished with his processing, you can. Okay, I guess they didn't execute him then. Why, why did they bring Steven in? What's going on? I just got here, so... Anyone? No one knows what Steven did? For nothing! They he brought him literally for nothing! ID. Okay. Um, he wouldn't go, he wouldn't come to uh, the train station to get said ID, he kept making excuses, so we took him in for failure to supply ID. Alright. No, please, no! Hello. Howdy. Hey, Shaver. Howdy. Mr. Black, Ms. Ivy. Hello, how are we all? Um, I just went on a right. little date, so that's yeah. so cute. All right, all right ladies and gentlemen, going I'm going to request you all dispersed into the town and go about your day. Thank you. Uh, at at say hello to the other, Adios, at least the other side of the street, if you don't mind. Thank you kindly. Hello. I can't believe this. Shooting a man while he's tied up in the... Yeah, I think someone did shoot someone. Yeah. And we can't even stand over there. We have to stand over here. Because they don't want us to be there when they bring out his gathering. body in the coffin. Oh, yeah, usual the sheriff's shooting Willie inside the uh, sheriff's uh, coffin. Uh, oh. Jesus Christ. I yeah, can't yeah, my doing eyes. him uh, execution style, you know? Right, fucking bastards. They put him down like a dog. Hey, Walt, watch You know, Willie's been having like a, a dog being an ass today, Jesus. but I'm pretty sure he didn't deserve that. Yo, exclusion. It's going good. Just shenanigans in Valentine. How you doing? The old one might be a bit chewy. They put the him others. down like a dog. Mm -hmm. that's, that's fucked up, man. What would happen if we all got our guns out at once? <laughs> they might be sure very quickly idea. moving to the other side. As in, like, further down the road. Maybe we should find out. This. I'm just watching today. I don't want to get involved either. As much as I want to, I don't want to seem like a bad person. There's more of us than there are of them. The people need to rise up against the oppressors. Yeah, you should try that, Valdivine. What? You should, uh, you should go first. I can't do it alone. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you show us how to do it? Go on, go, go I'm across. I'm too old for that sort of shenanigans. Oh Just whip them out. There, see, whip them out. Yeah, go on, go on, everyone. Whip out, whip out your. Uh, whip whip it out, out your short. Oh God, who are these fellows down the street? Just, Just oh. whip it out. That's it. I don't know. You know. Well, I mean, all you're doing is holding it. No one else is going to join the uh, revolution. No, I'm, I'm too old for that sort of stuff. I'm, sl I'm slowly walking towards them. My back hurts. I got arthritis in my knees and my back. I think it's getting to my fingers, too. Hey, Ash. Yeah, I don't know. You seem to have a bow. I'm pretty sure you oh, to have He's inching forward. Got a good point. Oh my god. Oh, well, there's the doctor again. Oh, the doctor's gone into the sheriff's department. It's because he's fucking dying in there! Maybe you should blow the side of the wall up and. I don't know. Get him out. He's made it to the other side. Are you alright, Woodman? 
Yeah, I'm okay. I was asking where Mrs. Mr. Stephen was and why the doctor had to go inside. They, they wouldn't <clears> tell me either. Or... I'll tell Anybody you where he is. Anybody got some cookies? I'll tell you where he is. He's under the uh, goddamn no. floorboards. So, I don't have a whole lot of information. The hell was I... all that confuffle about? I don't know. They're figuring it inside. I trust the, the officers that are in there. So, we're just going to hang out, be cool, and let them do their job. So how do y'all know Steven? Who the hell is Steven? He's just here. <laughs> oh, well, he's just a nice oh. man that lives okay. here, I guess. I, I, I don't know Steven. I've been around Valentine's quite a bit. I was getting so. changed, and I, you know, I heard a few shots, so I thought I'd come back. <laughs> Steven's Willie uh -huh. Ash. <laughs> Steven down, I repeat. Oh, would you go make sure the front door is locked? I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, oh, perfect. I'll double check me. Thank you. Have you been, Schuber? <sighs> been all right. One day at a time, you know? Yeah. Winnie was really worried about you and Doris. Oh? Yeah. Whoa. What? Um, what? Where'd that body come from? Oh. Uh. What body? That what one. the fuck? Well, it's gone again. Uh, you mean the lady walking by? Oh, it's yeah, uh. Walking by, man. That's Ricky Wilson, wow. of course, Ash. <laughs> I've nice never seen them before. I mean, that's pretty. Never dramatic. seen them no, before. No, she was on the ground, and then she was there, and then she was. Well, there. Man, she was just, were she was just walking back, walking yeah. through. Down a better day. So, what what do you mean, Arthur? What do you mean worried about me and Dolores? Uh, this is what happened a little while ago. Oh? Yeah. No, we're fine. We're good. That's good. I mean, late news to me. Uh, Are you talking about like three weeks ago? Yep. Almost a month. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good. I'm just gonna go check all the all the doors, Mr. Street. Thank you. I figured I'd just come hang out with y'all so y'all don't have to go running up to the porch, you know? Yeah, don't worry about it. Oh, we we, we like the porch. I, I know it's an attractive porch, ain't it? Yeah. You know why it's the best porch? Why? Because it gets swept the most during community service. <laughs> I mean, you ain't wrong. It's cleaner than most porches. It, they yeah, they come is. out on that porch, and it's the first one they go to. So yeah, no, it's uh, definitely a very clean porch. A man second one is bleeding out in there. Once the a man is dying in there, and you're making oh, jokes. Oh yeah, you should you should let Val in there to help the man with his blood wound. Oh Val, you you're like a blood drive guy, aren't you, Val? We need to have, we need to get him to Saint Denis if we have any chance of saving him. That's where all the fucking blood is stored. Who's this fella? Hello? Oh, you got another fella up on the porch. Julian, you want to <laughs> Oh, you got he someone up on the roof over the there, too. Can you stop creepily laughing here? <laughs> Very disturbing. My thank you. Good sir, please clear the area of the doctor's and sheriff's office. Thank you. At Shuba Burns, I may need you. Back up. Sorry. My god, the gentleman, if y'all would wait here. Proximity chat's Did working not, really well today. To hold one man down. It's been shot. Of course they do. Uh. Also, those are locals up at the rooftops, Woodman. Alright, I'm gonna shoot them off, okay? No, don't, don't do that. I can push them off. It's the same thing. Don't do it. There we go. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> 
Run, you fools! Oh no. Oh no! Who the fuck is shooting in my town? <laughs> <laughs> His town, what the hell? Them buddies full of themselves, yeah. I think. Ricky Wilson! Never heard I that one that before. that guy pulls his third leg when he talks. Usually criminals say that. But the funny thing is, with criminals, it's more true. They take what they want. Who is that guy across there? It's not Steven, is it? Is that the hero of Valentine? <laughs> oh, he's waving. <laughs> he waved as he said that. He is, he is the chosen one. <laughs> Maybe he will save Steven. No, don't walk away. Come back. Oh, yes. See, he's... T yes. He's going to kick down the door. There you... Look, <laughs> just wait. Here we go. No, fuck. He just <laughs> does not give a shit. Look how he's got the... Huge balls. Just these. I'll walk where I want. God, I'll jump on this wagon. Okay. I'll fuck your way. I'll jump on your I'm roof. I'm so confused what this man is doing. He's living his life. Oh, he's living Enjoying his best life. Oh, well, goodbye. Can't believe the law department just gets away with this. Hey, Vlad. Mm. Yes. You want you want an acupuncture session? A what? An acupuncture session. What does what does that do? Oh my god. <laughs> you wanna try? I sure with Are knives or needles. With... Oh god. That. Ah, 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 ah. Uh, he's dead. Why have you done? <laughs> He'll be fine when he wakes up. He'll, be, he'll feel like a new man when he gets to the help of the doctor. <laughs> the fuck just happened? I'm actually about to. Ah, you even to die. I don't have something to drink in the next. Uh, it wasn't a so. shot, it was an arrow. Right. Well, you can shoot someone with an arrow. Why'd you shoot him with an arrow? No, no, no. It was an acupuncture session. All he right, said he, what it was fine. <laughs> what <Acupuncture. happened? laughs> I put a arrow in the right places in his muscle. All right, folks, I'll get you to back it right up into the other side of the road, please. All right. Uh, is he all right to see the local doctor? Yep. It's all right. Try now. <laughs> oh my god. Do you need money, Vlad? Yes. Give me your right, money. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. This is grave public property. <laughs> Why you stop putting me down? Uh, oh. Um. This doesn't look good. <laughs> I didn't expect this to be this bad. All right, let me get Dolores. Oh no, I'm in the void. Oh, oh, hold on. Let me see if I... Why are you down. still holding me? You're about to put me down in front of the doctor. 
<laughs> Hold on. Can't put you down for some reason. I'm gonna need another five dollars. Don't worry about it. I'll give you more than that. Now I can't do anything. What have you done to me, my ass? Next time I'll fucking get you for good, Harkness. <laughs> Oh, don't worry the about it, you'll be fine. Five. Help! Let me scoot you That's out so I can actually pick you up. Oh, <laughs> can't, can't scoot you nowhere now. Oh, wait. Why have you done this to me? <laughs> Now this would be a little bit smoother, that's why. I thought the Where doctor would have helped go? him. I need to get Dolores, the uh, local doctor ain't working. You ain't killing me. Dolores. I'm gonna cut off your toes. You serious? Dolores. Again? Again? No, no, no. The local doctor just ain't working. He should be. All right, take him out the back. <laughs> no, please don't, don't <laughs> shoot me. Let's take him out the back and put him out of his misery. No, no, <laughs> I'm still so young and beautiful. You, know, you agreed to the acupuncture. So. <laughs> right. I, uh, so you, you shot him with ah! an arrow. No, I stabbed him before. Oh, out. jeez. Out. Put the knife away and get out. <laughs> if you don't right, leave, we'll see right the sign of Right the chest, Leave nope. now. Uh, um, <laughs> leave <laughs> neck. now. It's your first oh. To release tension. <laughs> I, I don't want acupuncture ever again. <laughs> Oh, well, that's rather interesting, isn't it? Get inside. Well, I'm definitely going to have to sterilize this because my main concern is being stabbed by something that's filthy and it's getting some germs into you, but my goodness. It's so very good metabolism here. Uh, my injuries, uh... <laughs> oh. I can pop some stitches in this, but you seem to be healing okay, Mr. Vladimir. Are you in any pain at all? It's... Uh, my back hurts. It really hurts. Oh. Maybe we should try and crack your back a little bit later. Oh, don't let Myers touch me again! <laughs> <laughs> well, my skeleton hands work wonders. No! Uh, I don't think we need to stab you to make your back feel better. We just need to sort of like get you to do some particular type of stretches to just crack the back. Is there anything you've been doing in particular that caused it? Maya is stabbing me. I stabbed you next to the neck, not your spine. All right. I'm not sure what levels of pain you're in, but this will help just a little bit. Enough for me to pop some stitches in that you don't feel it. I think your age is getting to your blood. Yeah, not too much. Uh, <laughs> lucky. Just much. Ah, it's all right. All right we, we, we got it. Managed I, to I, miss some uh, lucky arteries there too. You haven't bled out at all. It's, uh, oh. it's going to be just a bit of an annoying little cut for you. <laughs> oh. Maybe I could give you a maybe I could give you a hug after this blood. My face. No, Save it's my face! Face. It's just, just a neck, nothing on your face. Oh, thank oh, God! God. Me. I just rescued you from wolves that did worse damage than this. He's just being a little dramatic, Dolores. Don't mind him. They didn't betray me! <laughs> Love you, Vlad. You're a good, good friend. friend. Don't quit your day job! <laughs> all right, I'm just gonna pop a couple of stitches in, all right, and get you on your feet. Oh, come now. Uh, 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 
No. <laughs> Almost done. Almost God. done. My keep goodness. In mind, he, keep in mind, he well, consented. What's happening? So. Came oh. to double check. That oh, was around it's, around. It's, it's all right. Just uh, just mucking around. Nothing, nothing to see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm all done. I was done like two seconds ago. A <laughs> <laughs> real silly, ain't it, Dolores? Yeah. As I said, I've seen much worse. I don't like needles. All right, okay. I will give you morphine. Are you all right to have some morphine? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh. Jimmy, with me. Yep. We got another. Come on. Ah! <sighs> Might be a bad time. You're gonna talk to you in the saloon. Uh, sure. Just in a moment, oh. I'm gonna yeah, give uh, Vladimir some compensation. All right, no, no more stabbing each other. It's not necessary. Oh, thank All you, right. ma'am. <laughs> Myers, what the fuck was that? Oh, thank you. I guess that makes up for this little predicament. Myers, you need to give a bit of a warning or something, huh? Myers? Hold on. Um, I was asking for your consent, so you could have just said no. I don't know. I don't know if I even had the chance to answer. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's all right. Where's Mr. Steven? I did. I did acupuncture. Uh, the sheriff's all unloaded on Steven in the uh, sheriff's department. How's the acupuncture? How's the acupuncture? It's good? No! Would not oh. recommend! <laughs> Alright. Alright. Well, you know, you could always go complain to the mayor of Valentine. Who the f who's the mayor? Did you see the white horse across the road there? Yes. It's yeah, the that's mayor the, mayor. That's the that's mayor, mayor of mayor. Valentine. Right. Mr. Mayor? This is the mayor, mayor. Take it up to the mayor. Mr. Mayor. I just wanted to bring to your attention. He guns on him, boys. Just, you know, it's not a biggie. I just wanted to give you a heads Walker up. tried to pull a gun on me. That Arthur Myers here should not be allowed to open a acupuncturist a clown. building clinic. Bank. Are okay? Oh. Skip the saloon. Do what you do best, okay? Just, just not tell you how to do your job as the mayor. Just, just, oh, the, Mitch, Mitch is in the, just the top tip, okay? I love you too. Alright, this is going on. This is going nuts at the moment here. All right. Hey, just oh, what did the mayor say? He said, "Ooh, I love you." <laughs> That's him. So I said, "I love you too." That's the mayor for you. Cool, oh, he's a great mayor. The best. I love Mayor Mayor. Uh, so there's a fellow running around with a mask on now, so just be cautious. Right. Well, that might be enough excitement for me today. So, <laughs> yeah, I gentlemen, I'm going to retire. And I hope you all vote. Oh, there they are. They're in the bank now. Look at them. Oh. You take care oh, they're, of them. They're in the bank. Sorry. Oh. Here you go, journalist. There's about to be a bank robbery. <laughs> Don't forget, everyone. A vote for Mr. Dome tomorrow is a vote for the people of America. Wait, where's Mr. Dome voting for? St. Denis tomorrow night. Mayor oh, of St. Denis. Got... What's okay. going on, sir? I didn't understand what you said. What, 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 is there a vote? Tomorrow night in St. Denis. Vote Saint -Denis. one for, for Richard Dome. Oh, yes, oh. yes. He's How a very nice fellow. I, I, I ran into him not long ago. He's... A vote for him is a vote for the people like your good selves. I'll definitely okay, vote for them. Okay, okay. Well, I'll, I'll... Is there a time for this vote? It 
Check the posters. Okay, I'll go check the notice board, see if there's any Be posters there. there. You can help make a difference. Power to the people. Yep. The stables. Uh, well, here's the thing. Mm. All right, so I'm, I must insist. Okay, if you know what I mean. Uh, I could do two horses, or I could do. Alright, that will do it for tonight. I need to do dinner and get to bed.